Buffy, buff. Oh, thank God, my noise. My, my noise. My, yes, I. My voice. Oh my goodness. Cat, nay. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Hello, guys. <gasps> How you doing? What? Oh. oh. Who wants a cat? Silly love did. <laughs> Hello, guys. Oh, fuck. But, nay. Nee. Okay, are we going to do this again? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a war with this cat. Cat, we talked about this. I made a pact with Caesar that he can sleep here on the side because there's extra room. Right now, I just keep my notebook there. Look, I even moved my notebook for you, Caesar. Okay, not behind the keyboard. <laughs> you could take Caesar. No. Of course I wouldn't give you the cat. He's my cat. Look how cute he is. Oh my goodness. He's cute and he knows it. Look at this guy. Look at him. Oh my goodness. Hi, fat ass. Yeah, you know you're so cute. That's why he's showing me his whole tummy. Look at this fat ass tummy. Look at this guy. Who is this guy? Oh, you think you're so cuddly. You just think you're so cute. <laughs> what is this guy doing? Caesar, stop moving around so much. It's making me very hard to capture your beautiful face. Okay, if you're out, you're out. Yes, you're out. No, you've surrendered your spot. Move, move, cat. Move. No, never mind. He just wanted to get comfortable on the... Uh... On the escape button again. God damn cat. God damn it. What are you doing to me? No, don't mess with my shit. Okay, we're now he's he's on the move. That's fine. Ugh. Hello guys. How are you doing? I missed you guys. It feels like it's been fucking ages, but it it probably hasn't. Also, I have cat hair in my eyes. That's great. Thanks, Caesar. <coughs> Where's the water? Hello, Zippy and Dr. Do and Yin and Radio and Balg, Alpha, Carla, Syntex. What's up, guys? I can't stay long today. Who's going to guide me through Final Fantasy later? <coughs> Welcome back. <laughs> Throw another yellow on the wall. Hard to take the lead, BTW. <laughs> Thank you so much, Alpha. Thank you. Uh, and yes, <clears throat> the wall is going to be cleared. It's, uh, the wall is going down now, actually. Wait, first I need to take a picture of it. Like, I, but, I mean, it's beautiful. It's a bit messy. It's a bit messy, but it's beautiful, clearly. Hello, Frodo. What's up? <gasps> Eight months. Warp. Warp. Blue after you clear it up today, tongue. Boys. Eight months. Thank you so much, Jim. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> Is the best wall to date? Yes. It's definitely the best wall to date. Right. So I'm feeling, I'm feeling really good. But my voice is still a little bit fucked, so if I sound weird, that's my voice. Like, I don't know what happened with my throat, but I mean, energy-wise, and like, I can breathe through my nose, and I'm feeling good. It's just my throat's still fucked. But, you know. Hopefully we'll get through this. I still have throat medicine. I got this. Hey, Maximus, how you doing? <laughs> so, we just, excuse me. The fuck's that that you want red? Then you can have red. There'll be one red and one blue on the wall. Ar -la -ar -la -ar -la -ar -la -ar -la. God damn it, guys. Wait, so let me take a picture of this. 
Bag is having a date? Wait, you're having a date? Who are you going on a date with, Bag? Alright, let me take a picture of the wall. It's beautiful. Okay. Beautiful. For the next wall, not this one. Okay, I got you. I got you too. You revolted lots of shit in it? Well, I don't really think I can get an upgrade for my vault because there's only raid slots in it. And I don't think I have so many more upgrades from the... Like, I could get a better weapon from KT. That's about it. <clears throat> Thank you, Axel. I'm glad to hear you good too. Hopefully everyone's okay. I'm acting like I've been gone for weeks. I know it's not even like wait, when was what was the last stream Saturday? Saturday? Sunday, Monday, too. It's not even that long. It just feels that long. <coughs> Guys. Oh my god, Val I didn't notice you sounded weird, so you said something. <laughs> hey. I'm okay sometimes, but I can feel like there's something fucked with it. But I have this horrible throat syrup for this to help me with my throat. And I, okay, I did something really stupid. No, it's not stupid, but I did something. Oh no, that's sticky. I actually went online and was like, okay, I, I, <laughs> I started reading reviews for best, best like cough medicine or whatever and this one won because apparently this one tastes the best i tell you one thing it fucking does not taste good at all so i don't even want to know what the other ones taste like this one is an abomination it was like oh it tastes of honey and lemon it does not i don't understand how medicine can taste so bad like i do not understand how this happens Hey, Anjin. Be the next real. Well, uh, this is true. Yes, this is very true, Anjin. <clears throat> thank you for bad hammering, Ian. Thank you. I have some of it too. It's called <laughs> rum. <laughs> Works wonders if used early morning throughout the workday. I don't think so. Okay, this thing is fucking childproof. I cannot open this. I'm being a retard. There we go. I got this. I think the lid is supposed to be the uh, appropriate measurement for this. Oh my goodness. My first date after almost two years. I think I'm at the point where I can handle it again. <laughs> Val, come on. Now you gotta, you gotta tell us more though. Like, how, how did you acquire this date? Tell us more. No, Caesar, you do not want any of this, trust me. Okay, smell it. Smell it. <laughs> He's like, fuck this, I'm out. If he's back it up. <laughs> Cat does not want this. Okay. There is literally something that's pissing my eye off. And I don't know what it is. <clears throat> I want all the juicy deets about this date belt. Oh my god. Wait, how many times a day am I supposed to be taking this? Four a day. That's good. This is only my second one. And I can take one before bed. It's all calculated. Yeah, I think I, think I have a piece of cat hair that's like probably stuck in my eye. Like... You know how they say that eyelashes are supposed to be, like, um, what do you call it? They're supposed to protect your eyes. I swear my fucking eyelashes give me more trouble than, than protection. Uh, bottoms up, people. Let's go all up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is not good tasting. Also, I hate drinking syrup just because it's like... It's not like when you're shotting alcohol and it just goes down quickly. You literally have to hold it for a few seconds and let everything like drip. Like out of the, the thingy. Oh wait, I hadn't thought this through. I can't put this back on. Alright, we'll just leave that over there. 
and hope I don't get syrup anywhere. Caesar, I swear to God, I'm do velten here. If you tip this one over, now I'm gonna cry. Ugh, no, this is not good shit. This is not good. <laughs> Little Caesar was like, no thanks, bye. Caesar's really funny because he wants to smell everything, but most of the stuff he smells, he doesn't like. I love getting him to smell oranges <coughs> because he'll just like run the fuck away. He 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 will see me hold it and I'll be like, you want to smell? And he'll be like, let me smell. And then he's like, nope, I'm out and just like runs to the bedroom. It's hilarious. It's only really good because now I got this citrus like flavored spray that I spray on things that I don't want him to like touch. That's normal for cats. They want to sniff everything. <laughs> yes. But Lou means the actual sniffer in this house. Lumi will... Like, having guests is hilarious because she will submerge her entire head into their shoes. She's like, ooh, what's this smell? Super interesting, new people. Like, don't mind me while I just, like, lie here with my entire head in their shoe. She does it every single time. It's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Alright, I want to get these deets of Balg's date. Where are you? We met long ago. Now we met again this summer. She flirted with me for 30 seconds. I fell in love instantly. <laughs> oh, shit. Right, so the date's more for her benefit than yours then, Balg, yeah? Oh. No, Radio, if that tasted like honey and lemon, that'd be fine. But that tasted like death. I really do not understand how medicine can't taste better. Because, I mean, there's so much shit in medicine that's, like, not the medicine, right? There's so much flavoring and color and, like, filler shit. Like, to make the tablets and to make the liquid. Because the, the actual medicine part in medicine isn't that much. How can they not make it taste better? I do not understand this. I do not understand this. <clears throat> Thank you for lurking, Frodo. I'm assuming you're working, so good luck with work. <laughs> the weekly quest is nice, though. 239 from weekly chest. Wait, is it... um 239 from the weekly chest? Do we get heroic level Sanctum of Domination gear in the chest? I'm a huge romantic busting out all the goodies for her. Talking three course dinner one. Are you cooking, Valg? Or are you taking her somewhere? And uh, Yin, have fun. Eat some good pizza. See you later. Shots going down for this meeting. Let's go. <laughs> I do not understand how you can shot and work, Frodo. What the heck, dude? How does this even work? Do four mythics and get the chest? Yeah, okay. I just I thought it was normal raid gear you got from the chest, not heroic. That's pretty cool. Oh my goodness. Can someone grab me a scalpel and dig out whatever the fuck this hair is? Of course I'm cooking. Okay, okay, good man. Good man. What are you cooking? Lay out the plan for us. What do I have to do to score one of those dates? Ah. I can be an intermediator between Valg and Radio. You have to... You gotta actually leave the house though, Radio. I think. If you wanna try someone else's cooking. Even got some crafted wine from my buddy up the country. Holy hell. This guy's going all out. Going all out on the first dates. <laughs> it's necessary to shot. Extinguishes the anxiety and OCD low key. <laughs> High key. It's fun. <laughs> all right, Frodo. See you in a little bit. Good luck with your meeting. Radio, maybe you need to learn something from uh, from Frodo. Just shot, you know, just shot. And remove all your 
All your anxiety that you might have. Why is Caesar being so cuddly? He's doing the whole tummy thing on the keyboard again. Oh my goodness. This guy. We got Italian tomato soup, some pasta, and dessert is a secret, so sure. Well, it's not like she's reading chat. You could tell us what the dessert is. I do that sometimes. How do you think I end up on voice comes sometimes? Radio, I want you to know that I never think you need any kind of liquid courage to join us uh, on Discord or on voice comms. Just so you know. All right. Where is she? Uh oh. Well, uh, this is the part where I start talking about all the good shit that Balg does then, if she's here, right? I don't trust the internet. <laughs> oh. Well, Balg, I wish you the best of luck on your first date in what was it, two years? We all have faith in you. I, I, it's cheesecake. <laughs> Dude, why you love cheesecake is amazing. If that was me, I'd be like, heck yeah. This is a keeper. There is cheesecake involved. Who the fuck doesn't like cheesecake? Right? Also, can someone explain to me why my cat is being so cuddly? Just stay there. That's good. I think it's because I used to have a bed for him on the desk, but I don't know where that bed disappeared. I need to get it back. You agree, don't you, cat? Oh, okay. Caesar, we talked about you gotta stop pressing all the weird buttons. Okay? You gotta stop pressing all the weird buttons. Otherwise, you might kill something. All right, car lover. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> oh my god. How absolute, cr like, dead could my voice get today? I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Right. Okay. I need to probably... Uh, I want to say recycle. I did not mean recycle the wall. But get the wall rotating. So I don't forget any posties. The cat has finally gone back to his rightful positioning. Positioning. <laughs> to his, 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 his real sleepy spot. Yeah, my god. And I need to set a date with my mom because I haven't seen her in like three weeks because everyone's sick all the time. Oh, and I don't think I need to count the wall because clearly the Alliance won. Like it's not even the perspective. The bl blue, blue is just dominated. For, for for once actually usually I feel like it's the the horde that win it's that kind of week I think got a vaccine shot Monday and my bones still hurt your bones still hurt oh my goodness ah uh, Maximus I managed to get my unholy set all done and dusted last week actually and it increased my DPS with 1k it's fucking stupid. It's insane. <laughs> hey, right, Ben. <laughs> what happened with your ward brothers? What do you mean? There's there's tons of you here. They're just a little bit smaller. Does that make you mad? Does that make you mad? <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Anyways. It's all coming off now. Because it's the 18th. <coughs> and also, clearly, I just want to point something out. That... They, yeah, Caesar, I did say they were going to come down. Yes, this is... Yeah, that's okay. You can take it down. Take it down, cat! I'm going to let Caesar do the work for me. Oh, you're going to stop now? Seriously? You mad, bro? Hey, Shortcake! I'm good, thanks. How are you? Well, I got a 
my throat's a little bit rusty after I was sick. This fish made me sick. I'm feeling good though, but my throat's not a hundred percent, if that makes sense. Okay, apparently Caesar sucks at his job and he's getting fired. I gotta do the manual labor by myself. Maximus, you still need a headpiece? Yeah, that was my issue. Like I had all the shards and I had all the socket like gear pieces, but I needed the headpiece. But luckily I got it in my vault last week. So, there was good times. But yeah, it's really stupid that it gives you that big of a DPS buff. Like, I honestly think so. Oh, these are stuck really good to the wall. Holy crap. I tried on a black shirt from three years ago and it fits because I've shredded some weight. It's my best shirt. Oh, well done, Bal. Good job. You look super schnazzy then for your date. Oh my goodness. We gotta come up with a better system for this, you guys. Like a way better system. Caesar, I gotta teach you how to rip these down. It's just lazy design. It basically forces everyone to raid and to Mythic Plus so they're able to raid. Wait. Why do they have to do Mythic Plus though? You can't get any of the... Do it, cat. Do it. This is the one time I won't tell you all for ripping them off. Hey! You did it, cat! He ripped Mickey Marsh off the wall. Caesar, I'm so proud of you. Rest in pieces, Mickey. You need item level to get into raid groups, and you need the Domi stuff from set bonuses. Okay, fair enough. I mean, I guess... But I guess it depends on, like, if you're... It works more the other way. You can't do high mythic plus if you don't raid. Mm. I mean, I think it depends on. And it's also, like, if you're in a guild that raids... I mean, yes. Yes, you should be doing High Mythic Plus. But I also think that the 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 way they did this... I don't know. Like, I still think... I mean... Wait, what's the item level in normal raids? I know... <laughs> what are you doing, Cat? Because the Heroic 339 or whatever, like... Just get a Heroic Raiding Guild, guys. How hard is it? Oh. But I do get it. It's kind of like you want to do one to do the other and then vice versa. <laughs> Trust me, don't teach your cats to do it because if they like it, they will do it all the time even if you don't want them to do it. <laughs> yeah, I know. This is why I need to keep on telling him off when he actually does it. He's been good though. He hasn't been ripping anyone off the wall recently. Until now. I can't believe he had the audacity to do it. Why am I taking them off one by one? Just take everything off at once? How am I supposed to do that? I mean, like... They're... They're super... Stuck. I went from... I went from having them... Directly on the wall. When this textured wall... Textured wallpaper. So they barely stuck it all and they kept on falling down. And now it's like fucking super glue. <laughs> God damn it. Krabby's going down. I can't even get my nails under some of these. Normal raid item level is basically 20 levels too low to be useful. Really? 20 levels too low to be useful? The cat is always having fun. The question is, where does he want to have fun? Does he want to have fun somewhere where he just looks cute? Or does he want to have fun on my keyboard? And get in the way of my gaming? <laughs> <coughs> that's the that's the real question. Oh my... What the fuck? 
Rockies are like super glue on Domo's post it. Okay, I take it back on all of these post its. What the fuck? I did not think they were gonna sit like this well. If you quit putting catnip, buddy, you would lose it. Hey, 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 hey. I only put catnip on the places where I want him to be. So, basically, where he's... Are you chewing your own tail, cat? No, you're cleaning. Okay. Maybe not 20 items. This is 226, 223 for Savannah stuff. Okay, well, that... And the highest you can get from Mythic Plus... The end raid boxes is higher than that, right? Yeah, it is. This is Derpy Cat doing Okay. Wow. There is way too much reflection on this thing. <laughs> I need to get frosted spray or something. Actually, I have that somewhere. I have frosted ice spray. Question is, is it at my mom's or do I have it here? You don't raid for gear, literally any Mythic Plus will get you better gear. Except for, I guess, if you're raiding Mythics. Not that I know what the... Did you almost fall down, cat? You derp. He's gonna fall down. He's so gonna fall down. <laughs> he actually does that a lot. He, like, does somersaults and then falls out of the cat trees. He does it in the one in our bedroom all the time. I don't know why he's such a derp. That's a 1% type thing. Normal people don't raid Mythic for gear. Well, yeah, that's fair. No, don't fall down, cat. Okay, who fed my cat with, like, some hype shit? I know, like, Caesar is Caesar, but he's not usually, like... Like, whatever he's like now. <laughs> wow, so many horde. Are you talking about in-game or are you talking about on the- Ah! Ow! Oh, what are you doing? No, you can't have my hand. Let go. Let go. Apparently, it's cleaning time for me. Can I? Well, guys, this is the closest we're ever going to get to hot tub stream. Hot tub stream. I am I'm having I'm having my <laughs> my arm washed. Am I can I go now? No. Yes, I'm I'm going. I'm going back, Caesar. Can we just grab my freaking arm? What is freaking claws? Nay, Messias are let go. What's gotten into my cat? This is like the nicest, cuddliest cat of all time, and now he's like, I must have your arm. You think I'm dirty or something? You gotta, like, you gotta take care of me. You're like washing the sickness off of me or something. I don't know what he's doing. Hot tap stream. <laughs> if I ever do one, it's gonna be me like throwing the cats into the tub. Seems to just trying to stop you from tearing my name down. <laughs> Good evening, Kim. How are you guys? I can seriously not get these off the wall. Yeah, I'm gonna need to find something that's less shiny though. This is uh <laughs> this is way too fucking shiny. You know you can grind 45 right now from last Wednesday to Tuesday. Is that what you did? 45 right now in like one week? What the heck? He's wondering why you're taking his toys off the wall. He should know they're not his toys, though. They're not his freaking toys. They're my post-its. They're going with the other post-its.
You know, I don't, you guys know I've saved like every single freaking post-it. I have a pile. This is my pile of post-its. Plus, the ones before it was more color-coded to Horde and Alliance. Soon it's bigger than my face. These are all your post-its, Caesar. This is where I've been hiding them all this time. He's a cat, everything in the house is his toys, including you. <laughs> what the fuck? Balg! Good luck with your day, dude. You got this. Just like... Maybe go easy with showing her your axe collection and like your swords and stuff, you know? Otherwise, you got this. Yes. Well, this is why... This is why we hide things. So the cats cannot play with every single thing. <clears throat> okay, Caesar, you can go back up. It's okay, you know. Right, where are the flags? Uh, whose hordes going up? The lions can go back on the wall. Uh, it's not just subs, it's also like bits and donos and also channel point redemptions. So it's a nice fluffy mix of everything. But yes, the people here are amazing. Also, I need to stop this from reflecting so much. I'm, I'm panicking. What if I have something like inappropriate on the other side of my apartment? Someone's gonna like clip it. And be like, Val, what's this weird shape I can see in the reflection of this fucking plastic thing? <laughs> this is a really bad idea. Whose idea was this? I need a I need a chalkboard. I need to order a chalkboard. That's what I need. Oh shit, what about these ones? Okay, that, that I'm gonna fix that. Unless Caesar's gonna rip it down. There was two more. The white ones. What's up, Pop? How you doing? Don't take them down. I had to. The wall was full and it's the 18th. I had to take them down. Those are those are the rules. Anyway, I see you're super interested in this anyway right now. Never what are you doing, cat? Derps. Derpy derps. Derps cat. Okay, um let me do some poses before we move on with anything. So one for in. One for Alpha, and another one for Dr. Dew. Here's the pen. Hmm. Hey, many angels, welcome back. How have you been since last? He's trying to take down the ugly flag. That means lots. Take a cup of coffee. My goodness, that stuff is not good for you. Yeah, I know it's it, I know it's a lifesaver for most of you guys. But I have never gonna understand. Like I kinda wanna teach myself to drink coffee just because everyone's always talking about it and drinking it, but on the other hand, it's like nah. I'm not gonna do it and get myself addicted. Do you wanna jump, Caesar? Can you jump over? Do it. Go. Yeah, good boy. Let's put to Nate, Nate. Nate. You're not touching. I know it's really confusing to you now, Caesar, but you're not touching these ones. <clears throat> 
Well, I mean, I've been sick for a few days now, but thankfully I'm starting to feel a lot better. I just have a little bit of a throat issue left, but I am getting back on the men. Thank fuck for that. Being sick sucks. But on the other hand, this is like the first time I'm sick in like two years, so. Has it been two months already? Like so we Thank you so much for cake. What the heck? Another red one? Shit, I don't like time goes so fast sometimes. This is like I I don't I don't understand. <laughs> Yeah, it is sick. And it's like, it's been eight months since I started streaming and like, I, what am I still doing here? Like, you know, <laughs> existential crisis. Don't worry. I had my first like, midlife crisis when i turned 16 so you know it's all good here thank you so much for two months but yeah i remember when i turned 16 i um like I, like i can't quite remember what my reasoning was like in my brain but i basically broke down and I was like really sad because I didn't think that I was allowed to be like a child anymore. And I started like boxing up like all my toys and stuff. And my mom was like, what the fuck are you doing? And I'm just like, I'm 16 now. I'm not allowed to play with toys anymore. I gotta be a grown up. And like I went off on this whole rampage about like how I'm not allowed to do certain things anymore because they're now considered childish. And I am 16. Like, I'm old now, mom. Like, I gotta be one of the big kids. Which I wish I could go back to 16 now. <laughs> oh, that's fucking stupid. Radio, you're not allowed to say that this chat unless you say that you're all, you yourself are also awesome. Oh my god, Val, my fucking heart. Stay a child, you can be exactly who you want. Oh lord. I know it was ages ago, but still, yeah. I know, like, I laugh about it thinking about it now, because, like, of course. Like, I mean, I still have... You know, like, I have my Legos, and I have... I don't know, I had, like, 500 Funko Pop figures at one point. Like, I'm... Just do whatever you want. Like, of course. Completely. I don't know what got into me. No, yeah, it's just uh <laughs> But that was my first that was my first life's crisis. <laughs> now uh, I don't want to think about when the next one's coming, so we'll just we'll just park that, but do whatever you want to do. Of course. And of course I didn't end up throwing out like all my shit. I kept it all. Uh, many angels, Yin is out, or even slash Yin, is out getting some pizza with friends. I think he might be back later. <coughs> Mid life crisis at 16. Yep. Hi, my name's Val. Actually, I tend to have a crisis every like few years, so. I'll just say that do you want to make stupid? They may not blonde that money, but do you get Right, apparently, you haven't grown up until you start drinking coffee. This means that this is like Peter Pan, Never Neverland, where I never grow up. That's fine. That's fine with me. If I could stop aging now, that would be great. This is a this is a good point. Like in my life, I'm happy with how things are. But um. Yeah. 
I remember I used to be terrified of that when I was little though, because my mom used to keep on joking about <laughs> that she used to put like anti-growth like pills or whatever in my hot chocolate like for breakfast. And I was young enough at the time that I believed her that something like that existed. And the first time she told me that she put anti like like growth pills in my drink. I literally burst out crying. <laughs> so I was like, I don't want to be a kid forever. Like, you know. And now here we are as grown ups, and we're just like, stop it, stop it. Like an anti growth pill now would be amazing. I'd be like, hell yes. Half the mods are out having a life. Hey, 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 hey. We already talked about this. Also, I'm busy having a life right now with you guys, and I'm doing it from my computer, so it's fine. It's fine. What's not fine is this thing is not the way it's supposed to be. I want a new mic. I don't like this one. I want a shotgun mic, but it doesn't quite pick me up as good from over here. As it does when it's right in front of your face. This is not a shotgun mic. But at least I have a chin rest. If my head ever gets heavy, I could just I could just rest here. That's a pro. Time waits for no human. But what makes my heart happy is that you're doing well in life. That's so hard for most to achieve these days. The growth pill sets a little straight. <laughs> well, uh, thanks, Brodo. Thank you. Hey, I life is uh Life is a fine balance between doing the shit you have to do to do the shit that you want to do. At least that's how life is for me. Oh my god, such a hanky nerd, Val. Wait, you calling me a nerd because I was talking about my microphone? How does this make me a nerd? Because I said I want a shotgun mic and not... <laughs> the one I have now. Also, do you have any idea how heavy this thing is? This thing is as heavy as a brick. Like, I could smash someone's face in with this thing. I'm surprised I managed to find an arm, like a whatever the fuck boom arm thing, that managed to keep its weight. This thing is so heavy. And I don't understand why it has to be. Because I know, I know like a lot of people, right? So a lot of people will associate good quality with something being like heavy. Because if something's light and like plasticky, then you're like, oh, they skimmed out. Like it's super cheap quality. But that doesn't necessarily have to be the case. I don't see that there's anything wrong with having a microphone that doesn't weigh a ton if it's good quality. I think it's like. But I don't know why that's programmed in our minds to think that more weight means better quality because it's like that with like almost everything if something feels plasticky and doesn't weigh anything right away you're just like oh this is just crap from china like, this is terrible i wonder why you're resting your hicking chin on there <laughs> the whole scenario stank of nerd <sighs> you can be a nerd you nerd we're all nerds here i guess Actually, what's the what is the actual accurate definition between geek and nerd? Like, what's actually? Geeks are collection oriented gathering facts and mementos. A nerd is a studious intellectual. <laughs> Uh, apparently, 
And I take it back. We're not nerds. According to Google, a gamer is a person who likes games. A nerd is a person with little to no social skills. I'm, I'm, we're, I don't think we're nerds, guys. Because that would mean that you would all be incapable of typing into Twitch chat. We're, we're clearly one step above nerds. We're like a little bit, a little bit more social than Google's definition of nerds, apparently. <laughs> Most of us will be some combination of nerd and geek. <sighs> he goes, I'm an E player, no one out nerds me. <laughs> oh my goodness, radio. What the heck? Do you. When was the last time you touched Steve? Have you have you played it recently? Hey Doa! Thank you for lurking. See you later. I literally work in a shop that sells only nerd stuff. Oh dude, I know. Your job, like well, it kind of reminded me of the job I had, but I think we had more books. You have more nerd stuff. But I love, like, just walking into places like that that just sell, like, you know, board games and, like, well, as you say, nerdy stuff is amazing. I love browsing stores like that. It would... <coughs> I'm so sorry. I hate this. Because I feel so good finally, but my throat is still dry and occasionally super itchy. Would be nice to have a kitty cat meeting up in Stockholm. Yes, it would be. If people want to fucking come here once all this shit is done and over with, it would be awesome. Ah, you know what else would be awesome if my throat didn't, or my voice didn't, give out? Oh, you haven't played for a few months? Okay, fair enough, Radio. I mean, I, I got the feeling last time we spoke about it that you, um, that you hadn't played it in a while. But I was just making sure. And yes, yes, Kim. You know, I will be there. Well, I... I guess I will have to be partly hosting or, you know, guiding together with Cell and Anjin. But I'm very much looking forward to it. As soon as we can get rid of this stinking COVID shit. Yes, you will. You, you, everyone just has to decide kind of where they want to, like, you know. Do we want to travel through the country? Do we want to stay in, like, one spot? There's a lot, of, a lot of decisions to be made. But we seem to have a lot of time because, you know, we're going to get a fourth wave in September or some shit, probably. I hear Sweden's been handling COVID so well. I mean... I don't think anyone's been handling it particularly well, to be honest. But that's because no one knew what the fuck was going on. And every single country was just... Guessing and testing their own, like... Ways of getting through the shit. It's gotten worse in Florida as well, yeah. Like, don't get me wrong, I really don't want another wave. But the pessimist in me is like, yeah, we're gonna go back down under in the fall. I want to go to Sweden. <laughs> I literally dream of this magical Max place and all its fine dining options. Oh my goodness. I really, really, really hope that you don't get disappointed. 
I feel like we've been painting it up way too much. I mean, it's good, but, you know. Like I will say every single time, it's still just fast food. 2020 felt like a who can screw COVID up worse contest. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, maybe. Also, isn't it going to shit again in Australia? Didn't they basically just like lock down a lot of cities again? Because they were starting to get cases. Fine dining and fast. <laughs> Mux is not fine dining. I, I can take you to fine dining places. I cannot. But you're not going to get it at Mux. As a matter of fact, you'd probably want to take your Mux meal and go and sit outside in a park or something. Rather than um, sit inside. But maybe that's just me. I don't like sitting in... Um, I don't like sitting in fast food places and eating. If I can help it. Mm. Wow, my throat is really hating on me. I shouldn't have spent all that time talking to Caesar earlier. I was warming up my voice before stream. I was like, yeah, this is good, this is good. And now I'm just like, this is not good, this is not good. It's, it's all dry. Eating inside a KFC feels like eating in a public bathroom. <laughs> <coughs> I'm so glad I'm not the only one that thinks like that. Maybe not quite public bathroom, but it's just like how do I put it? It's like oh, miss it. There's nothing cozy about sitting in a fast food place. Like I'd rather sit in a car and eat it then. Hey, ruthless! What's up? Welcome back. How you doing? Okay. I got a new toy. But look at this. Oh my god, it's so tiny. I guess it is called a mini for a reason. But open up. It's stuck. Shit. I gotta break something unintentionally. No, do not press. That's just what I did. Good job. Good job, Val. Do not press. Uh, this is my film, I guess. Do not store in hot places. Store between 5 to 40. That's okay. It's only 25 degrees in there. That's perfect. Fast food places in Norway are amazing. Are they really? I have yet to to come across a fat a fat a fat food place. A fast food place that I think is amazing. And by amazing, I mean it's gotta be amazing enough for me to wanna sit there and eat it. Like as well. Yep, you're on the wall, dude. Look at my new toy! Foggies! I have wanted one of these, like, ever since I was a kid. But they're always so goddamn expensive. And once I just sat inside one for like three hours. What the heck, Zippy? Well, if it's that cozy. Oh my goodness. This is so amazing. Grazie, you got the toy you ever wanted. Yeah, speaking of being a kid and not doing childish things. Not that this is a childish thing, really. I'm just living my childhood dreams, put it that way. I got some button things. I have no idea what this is. What the heck are these button things that you can't even see, kind of? 
Are they supposed to go on the shutter button? I can pick what buttons I want. Hey, Epic, how you doing? <coughs> wow, I'm sorry, my throat is so botched. I need to go get some more water. <laughs> no, I'm so sorry. I will be right back. Shit. Sorry about that. I'm just busy dying on stream. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what the heck that was. I felt 
completely fine up until this moment and now i honestly don't know if my throw is gonna let me continue that much longer streaming we'll have to see i'm jacked up with more water and i've got a throat numbing sucker in my mouth ah but hello epic and daylight hi for azeroth let's get another posty up there hey radio you and me both no oh, well, i'm sad because i want to stream i really missed you guys and like i feel you know like when i was sick i felt so shitty and was basically camping out in the bed or in the sofa and then yesterday I started feeling like a little bit better and today I'm like feeling back to normal. Just except for my voice or like my throat being a little bit itchy. But like my energy levels are dear. And I really want to do this. So I'm just going to get sad <laughs> if it's not going to let me. Hello to how? Is there any airport close by? Why? Am I meant to say yes or no for these uh, cheesy liners? Are we doing a tourist today? Um, we'll probably leave it for Monday. I know I missed out on one. I know I missed out on our Monday or our Monday raids. But we'll try again next week. This is my heart is taking off. Oh, you're such a cheese to how. Oh my goodness, dude. Played an epic battleground with my older brother today. I had 46k HP, he had 20. <laughs> Poor bro, feels bad, man. Did he just keep getting one shot by everything? I just wanted to look at my new camera. No, die of cough attacks. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> You're looking all good now, oh my goodness. He didn't know I'm a PvP chef. Isn't that like all you do? You just PvP? Yes, look at my new toy! <gasps> it's so shiny! I had the purple one. Because the pink one was uh, like a really ugly nude color. It wasn't like pink pink. So I got purple instead. <sighs> I have no idea how this works. I haven't looked at any instruction manuals. But it came with 10 pieces. 10 pieces? It came with film. There were 10 slides in there. And this is... Oh, this is a shutter button. You got KT weapon? Okay, now I'm jealous. I want the weapon from KT. I definitely want the weapon from KT. But it does not drop for me. Little shit it does not drop. I got Trinky from KT. I want a Trinky from Savannah's. Wow. They actually included batteries in this? What the heck? They never do that. Hello, Raven. Welcome back. How you doing? <coughs> I'm just like, what? We were doing Swedish for three minutes. We're not going to understand anything. 
Okay, what's the time? 46. <clears throat> yeah. Ja, det är två batterier här från... Alltså, jag känner inte ens märket. Jag tror det står... Per... Per deer? Forum? Jag visste inte att man fick skicka med alltså, batterier. Det är bara tänk om skiten hade exploderat eller någonting. Det står inte ens att det är batterier i den här. Måste det inte stå typ att det är batterier? Det gör inte. Jag sa allt, jag är inte död, jag är så lost. Batterier. Du kan se att det blir bättre med det. I understand explode and battery. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, man, this is so crazy. But, also, I just bought a Polaroid. Oh god, my dress is just. Forgot. I am clearly not 100% fresh. I just bought a Polaroid, and then the battery was more. And this happens never. You always buy batteries extra. Det är rätt skumt. Men... Uh, there they are. Hej, Fabi! Hur mår du? Hoppas du mår bra. Is Val doing a bad react? Nej! Jag säger bara att de inkluderar dig i lådan. Det förstår du väl. Tack så mycket, Brodo. <laughs> Fast det är de inte. Jag är skitdålig på att byta så här. <clears throat> By the way, did you know the shuttle bullar från IKEA are made from customers who don't leave after closing time? <laughs> Nej! Men fy fan! Det var det ljuger. Det är inte alls sant. Köttbullar är gjorda på köttbullar, inte på människor. Okej, okay, det var ingenting. All right. Wow, three minutes is really fast. Guys. Don't talk shit about the köttbullar. Okay. Shut bullar are not made out of humans. <laughs> Though it could be a good tactic for making sure all the kids leave before closing time. Because kids love playing hide and seek at IKEA. Okay. I got another poster for the wall. Tokma! That's a blue one. So what I was saying, anyway, was that I was really surprised that there was batteries included in the box. Because I've never ever ever received something that comes with batteries included. It's always like, you know, sold separately. And I, and I always figured that was to do with some kind of like, like a safety thing somehow. Like it being easier to transport stuff if they're not containing batteries, so that's just why they never include them. But apparently, these included them. Batteries included is pretty common in the UK these days. Really? What? Tell it to me as a kid, like trying to buy new toys and then finding out that I can't use them properly because I don't have any batteries. Mm. 
That was my life as a Oh, it never used to be. It might be easier now then. That's why they left the EU to include batteries without breaking the law. <laughs> hmm, maybe, maybe. Trying to stay overnight in IKEA source is seemingly a thing for teenagers in the UK. <laughs> right. I know lots of like when I was at that age, it was a really big not like a big thing, but it was like like bored kids would be like oh, let's go to ikea and play like hide and seek or whatever because it's like such a big warehouse it's fun until you get kicked out <laughs> i've never actually done it but i could definitely be fun uh but proto thank you i think my bilingual skills are not that great because I feel like a klutz every time I go back to Swedish. I feel like it's not native. Oh, on my tongue anymore, really. But I do my best. I've been on an actual date to Ikea? What? I need to know more about this. How how does one have a date at IKEA? Was it literally like, you know, someone was newly moved in and then you're going on a date with them? And they're like, so I need to buy furniture. Like, do you want to come with me? I'll buy you coffee. And then you're like walking around there looking at furniture. <clears throat> how are you doing anyway, Faffy? You can do everything at IKEA. Do I love IKEAs? If you're shopping for yourself in Ikea, I fucking love it. There's so much shit you never knew you even wanted until you walk into an Ikea. First date, marriage, childbirth, funeral, all in one visit. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I can speak one language so better than I, lol. <laughs> well, currently... <coughs> I can hardly speak any, but I'm trying my best here. Well, you know what, Proto? It's never too late to learn how to speak another language. It might be harder now, but it's never too late. I wonder what IKEA would call their coffin range. I don't know. Would they be crude and like... Because obviously, like, Ikea likes to name things that make sense for, like, what it is. You know, like, if it's a... If it's a bed, like, one of them might be called, like, Liga. Which means lie down. So, would they call it something that's connected to funeral and, like, that stuff? Or would they call it something else? I'm not sure. Because they like being kind of punny with their names. I mean, you don't have to make the bed in Ikea. Ikea will make it for you. What's Swedish for widow's tears? Oh my goodness, that's savage, Waffy. Waffy? Well, that's your new name. It's a mix between Faffy and uh, Waffle. The Waffy. Um, Inkyals. Wait, Inkya is widow, right? Yeah. Inkyans tårar. Tårar being tears. That would be... That would be very crude. I'm sure someone somewhere would write a letter and be like, Yo, this name is not appropriate. That would 100% happen. Caesar, you gotta... Are you gonna be... Wait a second. Oh no. There's two different anchor points for the wrist support on this camera, and I don't know which side I want it on. Wait, am I left-handed or right-handed? Okay, there's two buttons on- Ah, but- uh, CSI. Nay. Have you noticed how much you're in the way right now, Cat? Nay, you know, also, you can keep on moving then. 
Go, go. Am I left or right-handed? I'm, I'm right-handed. I want it on this side. It's interesting. I'm not be able to hear any words when you're speaking Swedish. It's like you're just making sounds. There are words. I just, I even like broke it down for you. Like inkans to what are? It's inkans. Like Carl ever just wrote it, and then to what are? Okay, the question is, I have two buttons on this. I have a button here, and I have a button up here. And I don't know which button I'm supposed to press. Uh, when taking a picture. Because that's going to determine where I want to put the wrist strap. There's got to be an instruction manual here somewhere, right? Oh, no plastic on the floor. I'm going to eat that. Usually the one on the top. What's the one on the bottom for? I've got an instruction manual. Hey, Quix. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. Uh, that's how to put in the, the film. Oh, I found it. I found the little thing. Number 10 is power button. Number 6 is shutter button. You are correct, Michael. That one is the power button. And the one up there that you can't see because my exposure is fucked. That's This is the shutter button. Okay. Which means that I need to move the wrist strap because the wrist strap is on the wrong side. Look for the picture manual. They don't use words anymore. <laughs> That's, I, don't, I don't really need words. It's actually quite... A, I, I, like, I quite like IKEA manuals. Because... They, they don't try to give you all this unnecessary text to read through. It literally is just like the pictures of what you're supposed to be doing. They make it... Like, I personally think they make it so much easier that way. Than like, 10,000 things you need to know about this before you can put it together. And then we'll try to complicate it by explaining things. Like, clear picture instructions are just so much better. A shutter on the front would be bad ergonomics since you probably touch the lens a lot. Yeah, that's fair. I can see that. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. That's better. Look at that. It fits in my hand. Super cute. I'm not taking any selfies now though. This is where I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start making an OnlyFans for for Caesar. I wanna take pictures of him. Caesar, we agreed. This is how you keep. This is how you earn your keep, cat. I'm gonna get him like little toe socks and stuff. <laughs> and I'm gonna put pictures of him. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. Even if you're an extremely handsome cat, cat, and I know you would get a lot of. Uh, a lot of hits on OnlyFans. Does it use a printer or is it still chemical paper you have to shake when it comes out? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's still the the paper thing. Or like shake and shake, but you like... What, you, what, you, what, what is this called? You like, you air it? There we go, that's what I wanted. I don't know, does it say? I think it's a chemical thing. Because it's, uh... Like, the, the film is quite sensitive. Like, you're not supposed to put pressure and, like, bend them and shit like that. So I'm assuming it's because there's something on it. So... Yeah. And it comes out, like, it doesn't come out a ready product. It takes a little while to settle. Settle, settle, settle. I'm gonna read through this properly and then we can try it out next, next stream. And then I'll auction out pictures of Caesar's toes. Pictures of Caesar's toes. The camera's, yeah, this camera is super adorable. That's another reason why I wanted just this one. Cause there's like a shit ton of different Polaroids out there, right? But this one looked super cute. 
So that was a clear winner. Dude, I think it's really awesome. Because, like, when they they started, like, obviously, they've, they've been around for a while now. Like, the new Polaroids. But they've always been so goddamn expensive. I feel like they've only just recently gotten to a uh, somewhat reasonable price. Like, because it's the film that's actually expensive. Like, a pack of 10 costs, uh, like, 16 euros, I think. And that's, like, that's for 10 films. Like, 10 pictures. If they all end up coming out, like, looking good. So kind of pricey is it light oh uh, i wouldn't say super light it's like i mean it's definitely lighter than a nor than a uh like if you'd got a like a normal camera yes you don't have to be carrying around on a heavy lens or anything. It's just one compact little Polaroid. I almost pressed the end streaming button. That was not what I was gonna do. <laughs> is this gonna load my game? Here we go. Yes, it is. See what's in the vault, even if I have a very sad vault. What? Paper is really difficult to make. Some small cans are heavy and it gets to be a pain in the butt after a while. Yeah, I feel you. But this one's, uh, I mean, I can even get the... Let me Google this for you. Apparently it weighs, without batteries, 293 grams. So that's not a lot. And the batteries don't exactly weigh a lot either, so. Not too shabby. Nothing that's gonna weigh you down too much. Oh, so many quests I didn't do last week. I'm already at full health. Oh shit, there's a fucking potion there. Who put the potion on my scroll up button? Also, have you seen how empty my bags are, guys? It's, it's beautiful. Look at all this empty space I have. I'll leave even more empty space. Da da da. Well, at least Anima is easy to get a hold of these days. Well, relatively easy to get hold of these days if you do stuff. All those quest items, dude, leave them alone. What are you talking about? Look, these are these are ones I need. These are like for the Dark Moon Fair. Most of them most of them are for the Dark Moon Fair. Uh the other ones are <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what this is. Alright, look, maybe we go kill kill Jaden one day. And then I'll get I'll get some transmog in this chest. You never know when you need things, guys. Oh, why are my, all my auctions being returned to me? Instead of being sold. That's sad times. Sad times. I'm gonna go vault. <coughs> the number one... Number one pro tip of... Uh, World of Warcrafting is always hoard the shit. Because you never know when it's gonna come in handy again. You know? Why do you think my bank and my bank alts bank are all full of shit? Nobody left to buy stuff. You should try to list them on the FF auction house. I might have problems with that, you know. It might be a little weird trying to list something from one game into another one. I don't think it's going to work very well, Radio. Get me the vault. I'm going the wrong way, am I? Wait a second, I have a quest. Oh no, never mind. That was that was a boring quest. We ignore that. Why am I not mounting? What am I doing? 
It's been too long since I played this game. I have no idea what's happening. Oh shit, you do get heroic box. This is like, this is an alt week. That's a good alt thing. Uh, arms, looties. I don't know. What do I want? There's not. There's not really nothing I want. Oh wait, I take it back. <laughs> this is great. Those some. Uh, those are some KT cups. Wait, I didn't think I could get KT loot. I'm so confused right now. Even though it, there's no haste involved, that's sad. Why is there such why why is there such bad stats on this shit? This is just sad. This is really sad. <clears throat> I only need to kill him once. Oh, damn it! I should have hoped for a sword then. I thought that because. I thought that because like I hadn't killed him this week, like I thought it reset every week. I thought I had to kill the bosses every week in order to get to have, like unlock their loot table. Well, that's awesome. I'm at CSR. Me. Wherever you are, cat, you are not allowed to play with my board. That's my board. Okay, well, I don't. I gotta sim this because I don't actually know if any of these are directly an upgrade. Oh, cat's back! Cat's back! Abort mission! Cat? As long as you didn't know there's a chance, there's a chance. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Last week, I asked for the loot that I needed, and, it, and the vault delivered. So maybe if I had asked nicely this week, I would have received as well. How long is this gonna take to sim? Oh my goodness, way too long. This is bad. Once you kill boss, items permanently added to vault loot table. Well, that's really nice. I just like assumed that it reset every week. I don't know. I don't know why. But that's good. Also, what item level does the world boss give? I keep forgetting what his name is. Is it normal raid level? Two, three, three. Ah, uh, that's not great. Is there? There is literally nothing here. Unless it's soul cage fragments, any good? But mine are probably better. Damn it! That's so sad. Why don't you give us good gear? We're good loots. Got a waste this week to replace my heroic castle Nathria waste is pretty happy. Well, gratis. And I just ran in a fucking circle trying to go and hand the quest in. Oh my goodness. <coughs> How do I fail this much? This is why we don't like Oribo's kids. How oh, I fail that much? It's like I don't even PVP. But if I have a quest, I need to I need to hand it in. I don't even know what that does. I think I'm allowed to perch. Oh my goodness! <gasps> Wait a second! No one told me these were purple. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, I don't care about that, but... Wait, is that the only sword? What's the shield look like? What? Okay. Right. I need to start earning some fucking conquest points. Dude, this one's purple. 
<laughs> you didn't know I was almost the entire set. No, I didn't know it was purple. I never thought about it. I knew the I knew the set. This set was the color, but I never I never thought about the weapons. Yeah, damn. Now I'm mad. Who who else's items that I've missed out on that are super cool? Oh, yeah, it's only this guy. No oh, wait. You guys have to sell. This is not as cool. No, oh, no, I hate this set. This set's ugly. That's fine. <gasps> Heroic Leaf gains an additional two charges. There it is. God, I love that. I miss Legion. When demon hunters and druids were like, well, this is gonna be easy. And then the warrior comes up and just like jumps and jumps and jumps and like stops them. It's fucking hilarious. Okay, the raid bots. Apparently I should be taking self replicating tissue. Wait, what? I'm so confused right now. Is that- I have a back piece in my- Oh shit! I have a back piece in my- a cloak in my- in my bags. And apparently... I should be taking the cuffs. The cuffs are a 90 DPS increase. Vault, come here, give me my loot! We managed to go another week without taking Stitcher. Hell yes. Yeah, I already have this fucking exact same cloak in my bags. Whew. How did I not know that? God damn. Right, where's the item to remove the shards? There it is. Because we're gonna put you in there instead. And we're gonna equip you. Hey, what? That's so nice and clean. 240 on the dot. Nice, nice, nice. No, I do need to... <laughs> well, need is a strong word, but... I, uh... I have not yet upgraded my legendary, but I need 1.6. Something soul cinders, right? I have got 1.1. Gotta do them Torghast. <clears throat> Don't want to do them Torghast, so... Not today. 1650? That's the one, right? Hey, it's my old guildy! What's up, Pax? I still have my priest in, uh, in this guild. This is a long time ago. This was... Myth or heroic cataclysm rating. Um... <clears throat> That many soul cinders to upgrade legendary syntax. Any new mounts I should know about? No, 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 not really. Damn it. <gasps> no, I didn't win the black market auction house bid. Damn it. I completely forgot about that. The, uh... What's his face? The dragon from the stone core was up on the BMH, but I completely, completely forgot about it. Of course I got outbid. It was only on like, it was only like 35k or something at the time. Damn it, now I'm mad. I wonder what that actually ended up selling for. I'm kind of curious now.
Torghast has grown on me since I ranked up tower knowledge. <laughs> what traits in tower knowledge have made it... Well, nicer for you to do. Let's see what's on the BMH today. Ugh. Not gonna lie, my throat is not loving me at the moment. It will probably be a shorter stream today. So I don't completely fucking go and destroy it. Most of the traits are pretty- I mean, the uh, auto loot is amazing. Don't even get me started on that. <laughs> That's good shit. But I guess not having uh, torments and like everything. I don't know. I haven't even, I haven't really explored the tree. I don't know. I've only like unlocked the first two levels or whatever. I have no idea what, what's in the rest of it. Some of the blessings are fun. I mean... The broken beam blessing one, one shots a lot of ads. Oh. Well, hello. I like anything that one shot stuff. Oh, what? Everything is, uh, is gone. There wasn't a lot out today. An ogre piñata. That is really fucking expensive. And a market container. Can everyone else stop buying the, the uh, unclaimed market containers so I can start racking them up for cheap again god damn oh well that was slightly disappointing where are my peeps at Oh, no one's playing WoW anymore, Sag. Right. Well, I was considering <laughs> my internet died. Oh, sorry, Zippy. I'm leveling my Warlock. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I was actually considering leveling something new. Or maybe getting my DK some, some gear. But I'm kind of undecided on what I would level. Hey, Akuo! I hope you have a nice time uh, and, and enjoy it rather than having to just listen to the giant stage outside your window, dude. I hope you have a nice evening. But yeah, I was like... I'm torn between getting my warlock up and my wait I can't remember now get me to sinfall so I can log out what level is your warlock cold daylight oh shit didn't know me being here uh, you're gonna transport me inside, right? Oh, nice! Nice, 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 nice. Your Warlock's 55? Yeah. I'm about to get my Warlock. I, I don't know. I either get my Warlock up or actually start doing stuff on these two characters <laughs> not just level them and then leave them there poor guys but yeah i know i didn't make this decision why are you nervous akua are you nervous because of social reasons or are you nervous because of um like getting sick You'll be fine. 
I have a feeling though. I like left the house for the first time in a week today and it was like, the outdoors, what is this? Okay, well, uh, change of tactics actually. I'm logging out, wow. I got something that I really want to do in Final Fantasy. At least I hope it's what I think it is. Because I think I managed to finally unlock the quest to get up my mount. I want my chocobo! Oh wait, what's happening? They're changing my next weekend plans. This is not optimal. Okay, never mind. They're not changing my weekend plans. <coughs> oh shit. Thanks. Thanks, Wobbly. Thanks. I forgot to put game! Exclamation mark game! Fucking hell. Final Fantasy! X. I said, okay? There we go. Knocked it out of the park this time. I think Valorant. I keep on meaning to try Valorant and then I keep on not doing it along with so many other games. I'm so bad. Streamer trying to do mod work again. Yeah, I'm failing horribly at this. This is why I need you, radio. This ain't my ding. This ain't my jam. Oh, this is very ultra wide at the moment. Oh, dear lord. Help! Help! Cannot skip! Help! Uh, there we go. Configuration. Oh, this is loud. Um, I got this, guys. There we go. Now is the question of how much. <laughs> Can you hear the the music? that's coming from Final Fantasy and how much of the music can you hear that's coming from the well the music I feel like it's changing my music settings all the time <laughs> also do you have my look look at my legs look how thick and chunky my legs look like in this armor Right, what's the queue? Only 24 today, really? But I feel like it's prime time. What's going on? It's almost half past seven on a Wednesday. How is there not a bigger queue? No game sounds at the moment? Okay. We'll see. As soon as I enter combo with something, it's probably gonna blast everyone's ears off. I don't know why it does that. The fuck I had 500 yesterday at 8? <laughs> That's what I mean. So did I. Oh. Oh, I was busy drooling at someone's house yesterday. I forgot about this. Right. So can I just like clarify something? There are three spots. You can have a plot. Right? <coughs> you can have a plot in Limsa, Ulda, and Gridania, right? Is there only one... Is there only, like... Is this it? Like, is this it? Is there only, like... 30 slots or some shit? Times three. Like, is there only, like, 100 houses in the whole freaking game? On the whole server? <gasps> Scrubby! Hey, what's up? just missed my awesome vault dude and wow okay it wasn't that awesome but it was an upgrade i got an upgrade there is one with storm blood as well i'm pretty sure there's a few hundred plots per server 
Okay, but that's really not... I thought there was going to be more. That's a really bad plot uh, player ratio. I'm not going to lie. So maybe it's going to be slightly harder than I thought. <laughs> Getting a fucking house. I didn't do last week's weekly scrummy, if that's what you mean. But I, uh... <clears throat> I saw this week's is pretty good. I want to do it on some alts for, for mythic keys done. Not even keys, just for mythic done. Um, but yeah, me sad now. Me so sad because apparently I'm never going to get a fucking house in this game. You have multiple hubs for each of the housing areas. All right. That's a free so Yeah yeah yeah. <clears throat> yeah yeah, I'll, like, I'll, I'll 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 do it. I'll do it, Scrummy. <laughs> hey Rob, hey Bun Bun, how are you guys? <clears throat> Sorry if my voice sounds bosh. We'll see how long I can manage to keep this up. Cause like I feel fine, but my throat like my voice is not fine. So we'll see when it decides to die. But yeah, I just, I thought, yeah, I thought there was more. <laughs> also, what's the difference between why are some of these blue and why are some of these yellow? Does that mean that a grand com- or like, does that mean that it's a private person's estate versus um, a free company's? What the heck? Talk to Fairy Skipper and say go to another ward. Go to specific ward. Oh, wait. Oh, thank God. There's more than just... Th okay, because I thought there was just 30 plots. And I was like, that's it? Oh. Well... Thank fuck for that. Apparently there are 60... Wait, so there's 60 times 24 plots. <coughs> okay, thank god for that. Wow. And so then you just literally just sit... Because I saw the little, like, signs they have outside, like the postings or whatever, and you just sit there and hope that... One, one day it, it will let you purchase and not just be info. But still, what's the warning? C four has been planted. What's the difference in these colors? Why are some of them red and why are some of them? Bomb is refusing to diffuse. Boom! <gasps> you blew us up again, Kaisen. Welcome back. What's your news? Uh, tell tell us. Tell us. What's the news? What's the news? And we'll we'll try to forget that you try to blow us up. Alright, got a call from the civil defense and need to help another company out COVID related for the next three weeks, so my schedule is fucked again. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to hear that, Rav. I'm uh I'm I'm I'll be okay. I think it'll be a short stream today though, because my voice is not as good as I thought it was going to be, but... Hopefully it'll be back on the vent soon. Red close to guests, green open to guests apparently. Oh, I was wondering about that, because I could just like walk into houses and like snoop in their things. But you can choose if you want to have it open or not. Okay, so I'll sit here and I'll go through all the tabs and then I'll yell if I see one that's empty, yeah? And then someone has got to go buy it. Deal? So I hope there's someone here that's got millions. What are all these symbols? Designer home, far eastern, under renovation. Oh, shit. Message book florist garden. Designer home. 
Your foot isn't broken? Okay. Good. I'm glad you didn't fuck yourself up too much. So it, I'm guessing that you've just got a big ass swelling and um, it will heal itself. Someone wants to sell stuff. Wait, you can you sell? I saw someone had a little like a little stand inside their garden and there was a retainer standing there and they were like selling things. Do I have a favorite housing area? Um, honestly, this is the only one I've seen so far, but I really like, I do kind of like the layout of Gridania. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of Ulda, but I haven't seen what that area looks like. And I haven't seen Luminsa's either, but I really like Luminsa. I don't know. Let's go back. Where, where is the, where the, um... Where is housing <laughs> in Nosia? I don't even know. Is it here? Or up here? In lower? Oh, is it mist? This looks like it. It must be this place, right? It's this place, okay. Bye, Akua. I hope you have an awesome evening. Take care. Or I will go. I will go. Go party and have fun now. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's never gonna die. The goblet is the least popular and plots open up there more frequently. Is the goblet the one in Ulda? I take it. Or wherever the heck. I just clicked the wrong thing on the map. Great. I'm still learning how to navigate this map. Or? No. Oh no, I don't see anything here. Wait, no. Then what the fuck? That was the wrong one. Why did I just click there? I'm so bad at this. It's here. Oh, <gasps> I found the golden saucer. Well, I don't know how it looks like here, but I I can understand it because it's also my least favorite zone. But that's just because I really like it. Like, he, like I like Gridania and, like, Thaniland because it's, like, really foresty and nice. And, like, look at this place. It's really pretty. Obviously, I haven't been to the mist, so I don't know how that looks like. But I, you know, I like the area as well. Foot's badly bruised, gotta stay off it for a few days. Well, doctor's orders. Hope you're resting up in bed then, Sin. Also, thank you very much for the bits. I really appreciate that. What color posty are we doing today? Mist looks really good, but since it's popular, there are rarely any houses worth it. Is this, is the lavender bed still the most popular one? Because this one looks really nice. But I kind of want to go see what the mist looks like. Uh, take me back. I need to go back to Limsa anyway. Hold on. We got room for post-its again. Yes! Wall reset on the 18th. There is lots of room. I made it. That's a blue one right there. <laughs> All right, thank you so much, Raph. Yes, the blue one. Gotcha. Listen, you're going red if you don't answer me soon. Ravioli. I'm getting better and better at spelling this. Your throw any better? Not really. Uh, It's a little bit touch and go. It's like, it's fine, but I can feel that it's a little bit dry. And sometimes it starts tickling. And if it starts tickling too much, so I'm gonna have a coughing fit or whatever, then I'm probably gonna have to abort the stream, unfortunately. Where am I going? Yeah, I wanna go and see what the place looks like. So we'll see. I'm here until that happens. 
<laughs> what is it, Wobbly? We talked about this. I'm not gonna die. I'm just gonna, you know, have a coughing fit. I've already forgot where I was going. I was going lower, right? Yes, this is what you guys said. How the f Which means I need to go into the inn. Mists. Oh, wait, I can take the ferry directly to Mists. What the heck? Well, that's nice. Wait, do we need to call an ambulance? No. Uh, nay, scrummy. The farm. Hopefully not, anyway. Is there... Wait, but this fairy's not gonna take me there. Oh, no, it's because I haven't unlocked it yet. Oh, no, apparently I haven't unlocked it. Alright, this is also 60 plots. Oh my goodness. Seems like most people don't mind other people poking around in their, uh, like, in their estates. It's definitely a majority greens. That's for sure. What are the little bubbles beside... Oh, hello, people. Welcome to my new home. Just moved in, so hoping to furnish soon. Welcome here, and welcome to our FC. Plot 59, 13th Ward Mists. Please come see us. What the heck? Gives you a TP to Mist from Limbs I had to write. Oh, okay, nice. Houses are all about flicks. No, I get that. Hello, my friends. Feel free to take a little rest here in the diner. Nothing big, just a place for chilling out. And I don't speak French. If you see any Moogles, please call the exterminators. What? No, the Moogles. Bless this broken home. Open every day, sit and chill. <laughs> hey there. Welcome to... Whom's? Welcome to my refurbished bed. Feel free to look around and relax whenever you like as a lot of hard work went into it. Hope you will enjoy the experience. What the heck? Wow, people are really like into this. This is amazing. Welcome to Luminosity. Oh, this is where Lumi's gonna live. Welcome. Oh, we did it. I was like getting a plot. They managed to get a plot. Takumi Brothers welcomes you. Wow, people actually really want, like, other people to come and see their... This is my spot. And to see their houses. This is amazing. For all the aura gather. Embrace your dreams and whatever happens, protect your honor as a soldier. What the fuck? Hope you enjoy my house. Beware of the basement. There may still be some bodies. Oh, dear. I troll people with my house. I'm making a labyrinth out of it. Oh my goodness. The entire end game itself. Ishgard is apparently having a housing district added when Endwalker releases. Okay. We're gonna sit there and camp the shit out of it. This is very, like, this is very cute though. Oh my god. Oh, I actually had to pick one of these. Yeah, let's go to the first one. That's fine. <laughs> when I get a house, only cute cat girls are allowed. Maybe cute tracking girls too. Oh my goodness. I'll come as a butcher scrubby. Okay. Oh, there's a beach. Yeah, you're just, uh, that really does her like grease vibes. Well, someone's got an entire fucking party going on here. And there are balloons and everything. Oh, look at this guy's house. 
definitely cool. What the heck? Uh, someone put NPCs there to bow when you fucking enter? Oh my goodness. I approve of the library though. This is awesome. Oh. It's a chunky cat couch. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. Oh, I won one. <laughs> Slaves. Yeah. Some houses are set up as nightclubs. What the heck? You can have merchants and menders in your house. Damn, that's cool. And apparently a giant ass safe. There's a downstairs. Wow. That's not a lot of room for one shark. Oh shit, this opens up. Oh, it's got a bathroom. No fucking way. Okay, guys, it's time to take a shower. <laughs> My armor is a little bit dirty. I gotta make sure, you know, gotta be clean. And there's a laundry bag. Oh my goodness. That's pretty detailed. That's awesome. Wait, this isn't another door, is it? No. You can get married too, I heard. Touch the fishy. I won't touch the fishy. Is Caesar also sick? No, Caesar is not sick. The only sick person here is me. Oh, they're mannequins. I was like, what the fuck was that? It's gonna cost a lot having the shower on 24-7. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck is this place? Oh my goodness, this is kind of cringe. There's a lot of stuff going on. Oh, there's food. I'm hungry now. I want food. Oh, uh, what? There is an upstairs bathroom. Where's the toilet, though? Do you guys really think we don't have to go to the toilet? Like, I appreciate the bath and the sink, but what about the... T Could he not afford a toilet? This is kind of awkward. Is this your toilet, dude? Yep. Now I'm definitely clean. Oh my god, look, he's joined me in the bath. Oh my god, he's so I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. I'm good. That's a lot of bread. Hey... Scrummy, there's nothing better than the smell and the taste of freshly baked bread. Right? It's amazing. Oh my god, there's so much you could do with these places. There's a fireplace and everything. Okay, right. I'm not gonna I'm gonna spend more time exploring. What the fuck are you? Uh um, there's like a Cleopatra snake person in this house. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out of here. I'm going. There's a sneaky snake. <laughs> There's a danger noodle. Do all plots come with gardens? Or can you... Like... Oh, look. We can have a hot tub stream, guys. That's not happening. This guy really likes his... I, I've forgotten what they're called, but those guys, the Eevees. All of them have one? Oh, that's nice. Sin, you have to pick a color. Carbuncle, that's the one. I see an Eevee. I don't see a carbuncle, but you know. Okay, guys. Uh, I really, 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 really need to pee. So, Sin's gonna pick a color, and I'm gonna be right back, and... You guys can have the honor of looking at Otter the Otter. Uh, do. Oh, did you just leave out a picture, dude? You suck. Hey, Gubby! There is no purple. I don't have purple post its. Come on. You should know by now that I don't have purple. Also, why the fuck is this so overexposed? Fix this camera. Hubbies, hubs, 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 hubs. Hey, Lotus. How you doing? Altos, welcome back. 
select it and do slash iCam. What the fuck? Cat? You're not a cat, you're an otter, but... I can't paste things into... Is this a joke? Yeah, I can. <laughs> uh oh, I don't know what that means. Okay, unpause. Paused, unpause. I don't. Know. What? He left. You stinking otter! Come back here. Well, it was, it was almost an otter. There we go. Don't get that. Okay, so he's just gonna keep you company with the otter. While uh, I go to the bathroom quickly. I hope Otter the Otter has been entertaining. Wait, why is Wobbly saying he's gonna get banned? Wobbly's not getting banned. Yeah. Welcome back in. Ah, oh, did we ban that guy? I don't know, Yin? Uh, Yid was banning some people earlier. Did you... Was one of the people you banned earlier the person that Yim Sin posted? Utterly oh, cute. It's very, very, very cute. <laughs> but, uh, Lotus, I'm, I'm good. I'm glad to hear that you're good. I'm, um... Like, I got all my energy back, but my throat's really, really irritating me right now. It's constantly dry and itchy. 
but hopefully that'll go over soon. I got some uh, noscapine or whatever it's called. It's not called noscapine, but the throat stuff for like hosta and hopefully I'm gonna be good soon. No throat, no itch. Well, that's true. That is true. Uh, actually, I think I'm gonna skip the WoW raid, Yin. I was gonna play WoW earlier, and I was gonna do Mythic Plus and stuff with people, but I was like, ah, oh, I'm just not feeling it. I tried during the weekend instead, because I do want to do some Mythic Keys. I was just not feeling it. Maybe it's because I know I can't yell at people, because then my throat's gonna start, you know, then I'm gonna have a, a cough attack. I'll save the yelling for this weekend instead. <laughs> Five more days and I'll be on that wall, boys. <laughs> Score Lotus. I don't even- <gasps> You don't have a wall sub anymore? But who's gonna be the mage in our groups? Oh my god, look at this guy. Look at this classy guy with the hat. And the lantern. Okay, Sin. While I was gone, did you pick a post a, a post that color that wasn't purple? Purple, 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 purple. No, okay. Purple is not a color. <laughs> pick another color. I literally have. Look at all these colors I have. Okay, plus there's also a light blue. And there's like a whitish yellowish. Yo, pink. Yeah, there is a there is a very hot pink in the middle of the stack. <coughs> this is true. So many colors not even forming a rainbow. A. Hey. You think that's a lot of post-its? You wanna see how many post-its I have actually? At least out of the ones that I can currently find, there are probably other post-its hiding somewhere else. Why post-its are mostly yellow anyways? Who decided- Oh, who decided that the standard, like, post-it color was supposed to be yellow? That's a good question, actually, Wobbly. You should do some extensive research and find out who is responsible for that. I would like to know. Okay, I think these are all the ones the I have. Horde. <gasps> for the horde, you what? Thank you, Scrummy. Thank you so much for the bits. Yes, I will hoard you on the wall. I got you. Don't worry. <laughs> okay. These are all my post-its currently that I I own right now. That Caesar is very into them. Okay. This stack is as tall as my face. And most of these are kind of yellow. Actually, no, most of these are not yellow. Most of these are... Because these ones that look yellow, they're not the yellow. They're like the greeny ones. Not enough blue ones. Shit, I need to order more blue ones. No, I must have more blue ones somewhere. Uh-oh. Okay, I found one more blue one. Yes, yeah, so we're running out of blue ones, apparently. I don't need that many blue ones. Okay. I got two blue ones. Or two of the correct blue ones, anyway. And Caesar is loving these as a scratching post. Cat, this is not a scratching post. Did you know that? Not enough red. Hey, there's plenty of red ones. Okay, Sin, you literally have a rainbow of colors here. Pick one. Purple is like the only color I don't have. Just paint the red ones blue, problem solved. Caesar, what are you doing? 
Wow, he literally thinks this is the perfect scratching thing. I'll try my best to level alliance for Mythic Plus. Hey, we can do low Mythics too. Like, that's fine. I can, you know... I get you low mythics as well. He sent marking it. He's like, these are mine. But they're not his though. Uh, I put it over just for now because I kind of panicked at how reflective this whole thing is. I need to fix that. It's literally like a mirror. <laughs> he was very annoying. Okay, well... Seeing as Sin's not replying to me. Yeah, you can see the TV being on. You can see everything. Okay, so I have too many post-its. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, red. Blue. Green. What you're watching right now, it's the, like, just a Netflix screensaver thing that's going on. So that an image isn't burnt onto the screen. Because posters were originally scrap paper and scrap paper was yellow. Other than that, no reason. What? Look at this smart... These smart peoples. Or turn it off. Nah, I know it, it should be off. I will turn itself off automatically though. It's good. Caesar, this is a keychain that you cannot have. <gasps> right, so I ordered more... No, you're not having this. I <laughs> ordered more things to make keychains. And I think I'm gonna... <coughs> I'm gonna start making more keychains. And I'm gonna do, like, a new one each month. And then figure out a way to, uh, like, do giveaways with them. So... There'll be a September keychain, and then there'll be, like, an October one. The October one's gonna be a good one, because that'll be, like, a Halloween-themed one. So I haven't decided if that's gonna be like a pumpkin or a ghost or we started a keychain collection. Yes, we are. I just haven't decided how we trigger giveaways for them, but there will be there will be one keychain every month. Starting September, I think. And then yeah, I don't know. So some way to Murloc keychain win. <laughs> Can April be a clown? Yeah. If I can, um... Um... Figure out how to make a murloc in such a tiny thing, then maybe. Is cat huge or Val tiny? Cat is huge. No, I'm joking. Uh... School. Aren't they a bit expensive to ship, though? Because you can't put them in an envelope. Yeah, I can't. Why can't I not put them in an envelope? That's how I shipped the keychains from uh, my birthday stream. I just put them in an envelope and shipped them off. <laughs> hey, Henny, how are you doing? Welcome back. Uh, it won't be a cake, though, because th this is for the anniversary stream. Don't know, my friend in Germany said it has to be a package, otherwise post office won't accept. Wait, what? Oh. That's weird. Um, we're allowed to send env like envelopes. Um Yeah. I I like I didn't have a problem shipping them off anyway. Because they don't weigh anything. So all my envelopes were like under 50 grams. Just to ship them off. So, not that. But I mean, if something changes, then I can just send you 
Polaroid pictures of the keychains instead. That's like the same thing, right? I don't know. Yay, thanks, Hitty. I'm feeling a lot better. It's just my, my throat is still a little bit dry and iffy. So drinking lots and hoping that my voice will survive for a little bit longer. Germany might be a special case. Well, I hope that... Well, I know that some of my keychains have arrived anyway. And I hope the... Uh, I hope the ones that I sent outside of Europe are going to arrive as well. Hopefully. Because I sent two outside of Europe. I arrived in goodly news. Yay! Um, I, uh... Because the thing is, here you can send anything however you want it. Like, if you wanted to wrap something up in a in a paper bag... And just slap an address onto it, like... That's fine. Or put something in a plastic bag and slap an address onto it. Like, you can do that. Okay, Scrubby, I've already lost the horde post-its there. <laughs> so... Hopefully we should be good. Send the next one between two kinder cards and put a post there with the address on it. Do you know what? It would probably arrive crushed and it, uh, maybe the post it would fall off. But if you attach the post it with tape or glue, it would arrive. Within the EU though. Because it's food i'm no it wouldn't get accepted to like australia and places i'm sure but like within the eu that'd be fine put a little sword on it <laughs> okay this i can do i think that's a bit of a skew sword but Alright, uh, I butchered this sword completely. I tried making it pretty and I just failed and it's getting worse and worse. Oh, I'm making it worse and worse. You know how you like when you botch a job and then you try to keep on fixing it and it gets worse and worse? But there's a tiny little sword on it. <laughs> I'm kind of curious to try and see how it would arrive. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, let's maybe not. But, Otter the Otter is back for your entertainment. Are you allowed to get alcohol delivered in Sweden, by the way? Um, I guess so. Yeah. The thing is, like, when it comes to our import laws, like, usually stuff is fine, as long as it's not... It's, like, like within reasonable quantities. I've never had alcohol delivered to me, though, but... I mean, you're allowed to bring alcohol into the country and stuff, so I don't see why it would be... I think I watched... Annie and box a box and there was alcohol in it like so that's fine I guess drugs okay well slow down slow down here radio how long are you gonna keep on raiding when you don't want to apparently <laughs> good luck with the raid radio no we're not smuggling drugs at all no 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 until I lose my mind. Please don't lose your minds. Losing minds are not good. I kind of want to visit. What was the other spot called that you said that isn't as popular? The Ulda plot spots. I have to do. I have to look at that later. But for now, oh my goddamn chocobo! Oh, the goblet. Uh. 
Oh my god, I need to come up with the sweetest titles ever. Okay. Swedish girl. Yes. Choco. Choco? Cho. Chocobo? I don't know. We'll find out if that works or not. Uh, I've already forgotten where I'm going. Does anyone uh, know? Is this the right place? I don't know. It could be the right place. It, could, it might be the wrong place. I have no idea where I'm going. It was the... It was the right place. Poggers. I went to the right place. Okay. Before my voice dies out, I need to be able to do this one thing. Right. This this actually means that I get my mount, right? This is a chocobo whistle. This means I get my mount. Finally. Otherwise, I'm gonna cry. Instead of title, I read little, so I read little Swedish girls get chocobo. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. Yes, private storm dragon is here to get my mound. I don't care about anything else that you have to say. Such a steering soldier of the maelstrom deserves her own steed. Let us see about having one issued to you. It's only a whistle, a whistle, a whistle. No, I know that the whistles in this game is someone's mouth. Don't you try. All you need to do is obtain a Storm Chocobo issuance by exchanging company seals with the Quartermaster. Once you've done this deed, present it to... La 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 la. And she will see you saddled up on one of our trusty birds. Wait a second. How many seals do I need? <coughs> I really want to move somewhere so I can order alcohol with my groceries. Well, you can't do it here, that's for sure. You cannot. <laughs> ah, I need, I need, I need, I need seals. I don't have, I don't have, I don't have this many seals. 200, you get 300 from MSQ though. Which MSQ? I continue doing the MSQ. Look, I'm level 30. I've had this quest for two levels. So we didn't do disappointment. Yeah, dude, they've got monopoly on uh, liquor here. Oh, wait, I have 300 seals. Wait, then why can't I go over there? I have 300 seals. So why isn't she letting me... <laughs> oh. What am I even doing? This is literally, this is literally where I need to go. She hates me. We're going back. I need to buy the issuance. Oh shit. I knew that. Uh... Oh my god! Go, 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 go faster, faster, stronger. Wait, what's the TP called? Oh, never mind. That's literally lower decks. Fuck my life. I'm so bad at this teleportation system. Shush, 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 shush. I saw it. I'm just... Guys, 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 guys. I'm too hyped for my chocobo. Do you think I have time to reach it like this? Do you... Do you? <laughs> Faster. This is, this, is, this is way too long. Give me my shit. Run faster. Go. 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 I want my chocobo. What are the job thingies, by the way, that I really need? Do I really need one? Yes, you need to do. You need a job thingy. Your job is like your, your spec. Uh, wobbly. Skull! 
Shit, we gotta drink first. That's alright. My 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 throat can last a little bit longer. Want a bird issue? Yes! Uh, I have a chocobo issuance. It's in my bags. Here you go. Invincible wishes you were this hyped about him. Oh, I am this hyped about Invincible when he wants to drop. So I'm handing over the invisible item. Apparently everything appears to be in order, but it's an invisible item. Why don't you drink warm tea? Scrummy, I don't like tea. I have a really hard time. So I don't even have any, even if I wanted to. But uh, yeah, I'm not a fan of warm tea at all. No, I didn't do any... Like, Alpha is a boss and has lockouts. But I was... I was just... I was so knackered last week. But we'll do it on Monday again. Warm milk with honey. Ah, uh, I don't have warm milk either. <gasps> this is my chocobo! Are you gonna give this one to me? I don't have milk. <laughs> a, gallon of sugar, a gallon of sugar will make any tea taste good. Hey. But then... Then it will, uh, then it will be too much sugar. You know the calories? Buy some. Wait, I have to name my chocobo? You guys did not prepare me for this. You did not prepare me for this at all. Choco Bay. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I don't have to name all my mounts, do I? Because I'm never ever going to advance in this game otherwise. Bobo. I'm going to name him Bobo. <laughs> no, but oh my god. Okay. Call it Caesar. But then, then Caesar's going to get really confused as to why I'm yelling at an in-game Caesar all the time. Call it invincible. You can pre pretend. You named yours Heminari, Thunder, and Japanese. Eh, that's not bad. But it's just a mount. Like I don't care. What, what does what does the mount name actually matter? Is this the only mount that I need? Like, what about all the other mounts? What about when I get a fat chocobo? It would be cruel to call it invincible. I'm not gonna name it wasabi. Uh, okay, we don't- I don't care about, like, uh... A mosquito. Chunky Cho? Cho Cho! Choo Choo! No. That's not even how you spell that. This amount is special, can also be a pet level 40, thus it needs a name. Damn it! Can I rename him at any point? <laughs> I, I wish that you guys had warned me about this before. I can rename him. Oh my god, thank fuck. <laughs> I still can't name him, boo boo. Choke on the. Oh my goodness, Wobbly. Oh my goodness. Or can you? What? You're evil! Okay, what are chocobos? Chocobos are chickens. They pick. Filler <laughs> underscore name. Um, we're gonna name you. It smells like foods. Anduin. I'm gonna name it Anduin. It's a chicken. It's a chick. It's a chick. Ch verb. Verb. It's a Christmas dinner. What the heck? Mac Nuggets incoming. I can't call it. I can't call it Mac Nuggets. That's just cruel. That's just really cruel, guys. Snoopy. <laughs> what does Arashi mean? Thanksgiving, guys. This isn't. This isn't. You know, we're not. Or I, Poppy, what the fuck? 
Arashi meets Storm. That's pretty nice. Why would a chicken be Storm, though? But how am I supposed to scream this? <laughs> you got that from TikTok. Yeah. I should name him Poppy. But then Poppy's too much like that, though. Like, Pop... Poppy. Pa... Pa... I... <laughs> I kind of want something that's, like, uh... Like, short. Like, Coco, Boo Boo. Poppy, Bob, 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 Bob. <laughs> it's a chicken. It's like a pick, pick. A marble. That's that's genius, Bob. But I can't, I can't name him after chocolate though. Pikachu, so you can yell, go Pikachu at the start of every race. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Burb. Or maybe just burb. Marble turkey flavor went. Oh, that's disgusting, Mop. That's disgusting. <laughs> Good luck with your raids, Grubby! I hope you get some good loot. Thank you for lurking. Can I put... No, it does say alphabetic characters only. Squall! <laughs> milk. Milk milk? You can call him milk milk. I'll call him pick pick. That's what things do, right? Pick pick. <laughs> right, we'll go over that, Rashi. That's fine. It was a good name. Thank you again. And then one day I'll have to- Oh shit, come back here! And then one day I'll wake up and I'll be like... No, I want to name him Steve. Steve, come back here. Simply blow into it and your feathered friend will come bounding to your stride. Yeah. But do forgive him if he doesn't respond when summoned in crowded city areas or monster, monster infested lairs. Chocobos are stout hearted creatures, but they have their limits. Shit, I require a chocobo rider's license as required by the law. Do you guys have one of these? No wonder you guys are all shitty drivers. No, but seriously though, they would be hilarious. Because I would be like that. I'd be like, Steve! Damn you, Steve. Or like, Dave, Dave, come back here, Dave. That's fine, that's fine, Ian. Oh, shit. Do I have to open my mouth journal? Uh... <laughs> okay, I need to put this on a key binding somewhere. You can't be out of here, I want to mount my mouth. have a gliding license in Genshin Impact. Can I mount my mount here? <gasps> Wait, how do I dismount? Uh, oh, okay. No, come back here! Come back here! Come back here! I've got my very old chocobo. Da -da -da -da. Oh, did he try to flap his wings? He's so cute! Oh my goodness. Okay, what's my This is your life now. You can't dismount ever. <gasps> You're eating chocolate chip muffins? You gotta send me some, Annie Angels. You gotta send me some. Look at this though. Look at this though. Look at this though. Okay, I need to go collect armor. To... I need to swag my chocobo. Also, I can now get to places faster. With his little wings, though. Looks like he's trying to flap, but he can't do it. Because technically, he shouldn't be able to fly. Swag my chocobo. <laughs> Why is this a sad day, Wobbly? Why? 
I can't make fun of her not having a mount anymore. <laughs> hey, when can you get your mount? Hey, CSR. Hey, to CSR. CSR, Frita bought it. Nay! Kept. Wait, why did it. Oh, I thought it was gonna load me back in. This mount looks delicious. No! Remember to do your class quest. Yes, thank you. Bringing down the mountain. Oh yeah, this was the one that I I couldn't do it until I hit level 30. But I just hit level 30 now, so... I'm good to go. On that front. This is super exciting. I got my own Jokobo, you guys. I need to... I need to re rebind the... Uh, the key binding for that though let's see uh hot bar one two three four f control shift i want you on shift nine yeah that's fine yeah there we go <laughs> squad <laughs> thank you for trying to keep my throat from dying on me lotus I appreciate that a lot. Okay. But. Now that I'm level 30. And I have a mount. I can get the polar bear. Right? So the question is. Where the heck do I get the polar bear? Because I'm pretty sure that quest was in Limsa, wasn't it? One step up. Aft Castle? Alright. Hello, Katie. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome. And then up. Up. Up as in... Up? Up there? No, down? <laughs> What's it called? Unseasonable chills? That sounds... That sounds like... Because it's an ice cream thing, isn't it? It's unseasonable chills. Yeah, that's the one! <gasps> Give me! Oh shit! Are these the... I didn't say that there was vendors with like their old stuff. No, okay, I don't care about that. I already read this. This is no, it said it's, 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 there's a fair, and you have ice cream, and you have polar bears, and you're gonna sell me stuff later, maybe after I do the quest. Oh, she's tall. Hey, welcome, Katie. Are you Swedish? Just wondering based on your name. Do it. Welcome, my adventuring friend. Come to enjoy the Moonfire Fair festivities, have you? I promise you're in for a scorchingly, swelteringly good time. As you may very well know, the fair is a story tradition that in recent years has served to promote the effort of the Adventurers Guild on behalf of Eorzeans everywhere. Once again, we got a piping hot plate full of exciting activities for one and all. This year, we've also been tasked by none other than Master... Arlarlar... <laughs> <laughs> our over generous patron of the event with creating the ultimate icy dessert to stave off the heat. We more than welcome the aid of a skilled adventurer like yourself, and needless to say, we'd reward your efforts. If you'd be willing and able to lend a hand, simply hop over to Costa del Sol and speak to my colleague Hermaga. D these names. <laughs> oh, now you read the quest. Yes, because now the quests are exciting. <clears throat> We're going to Costa del Sol. I have no idea where this is. Oh. Oh. That's a, that's a, that's a long way there. Uh, how the heck do I get here if there's no connecting? I can get her somehow. That's fine. Where am I going? I'm going down there. Where's, where's a crystal? There's a crystal. You swim? Really? Oh my god, give me another two mounts in one day. Can I do this? Where did I say I was going? Fisherman's. 
To the fairies! This is not the way, that's the way. You haven't been playing WoW for you because your computer is broken. I'm sorry to hear that. But welcome to another Swede. Yes. Let's go to Costa del Sol. I will make sure that you can make your ice cream. <clears throat> and you will give me a mouse. Wait, am I literally supposed to swim over there? You're making that up. Or can I? Am I allowed to? What the heck is that? <gasps> I got a chocobo! Oh shit! No, he doesn't want to swim! Damn it. He didn't want to swim. <coughs> Cubby! Thank you so much for gifting Kata. Oh, a subby. Thank you, Guffy. Yeah, apparently you can swim. Welcome to the cat crew, Cade. Oh my goodness. Right. Are you guys both for the horde? Oh goodness me. Is that two horde post-its on the wall then? Hello, new work. Can we have this, please? It depends on where you are, though, because there's a lot of places where you cannot, like, get into the water. Like, if it's at the edge of the map. But I can't seem to swim under the water, though. Is this true? I can't, like... Eh, I can't get down there. All right. Kate and Guppy! Whoop whoop! Thank you so much for gifting a sub to Kate. Ooh, I am also putting on the horde wall. Seeing as it was a targeted sub. And I saw you guys were speaking about horde romances. <laughs> Thank you so much, Guppy. Oh my goodness. Uh, you can dive in storm blood? Okay, cool. Yeah, apparently there's nothing weighing me down. Not heavy armor or anything. Oh wait, that's a pretty mount. That's a mount? That is one super cool fucking griffin. Oh my goodness. You're a spy. <laughs> you have alliance as well. That's good. Yeah, uh, most of us have both like alliance and horde characters, so that's fine. Welcome, friend. I hope you enjoy the festivity. Wait a minute. That's adventurous garb if I ever saw some. Did Mayaru send you to help with our confectionery challenge? Yes, indeed. Oh, how glad I'm to hear God's honest truth. We're in a bit of a bind here. You see, though we've been tasked with making the most delightfully frosty dessert, we are suffering from a lack of an all-important ingredient. Ice. The shipment was supposed to come in bells ago, but word has it it's been held up by some disturbances in the area. Might you be so kind as to check my associate... Poboyano? Poboyano. <laughs> these names, I love these names. To see if she knows anything further. She should just be east, o east of here over on the beach. Uh, I would I would be careful with saying replace. I'm in the I'm in the camp of play both. I don't think uh, I don't think they're mutually exclusive. You don't have to stop playing one just to play the other. I'm like it's okay to do both. Both is good. <coughs> What's up? I'm here to get you some ice. But apparently she's not talking to me. Here we go. Hermaya sent you to ask about the delayed shipment of ice. Yep. The situation is a complicated one. As you must have heard this year's festivities, Master Gigeru. Ruyu. Gig Gigeru. Oh my god, these names are killing me. Okay, that's fine. 
He promised us he would not spare a single guild to see the deed done, so we decided to enlist the services of one of the realm's most prominent confectioners. All well and good to this point, yes? Turns out this confectioner was a hopeless perfectionist, insisting that only the finest ice in all of Eorzea would serve for her creation. She hopped on the next vessel to the northern seas. And never came back, or what? We need ice! Where's the ice? That's the last we saw of her. It's not that I fear for her life, mind you, pardon the pun, but she's one tough cookie. That said, the festivities are all but upon us, and if she doesn't make it back soon, no ice cream for the kids! What? The poor girl's drowning out there. I will save her! Names are easy, just mar -lar -lar. <laughs> What do you think I do? Yeah, there's a lot of heat on WoW and Blizzard right now, for sure. Okay. <laughs> it's the confectioner we just spoke of. What? She's the one drowning. I'll help. Out of the way. I got this. I got this. Run. Wait, what? I don't even have to rescue her. She's already been brought up to shore. Oh, of course it's a Lala fell. Yes, because the Marauders got healing powers. Don't leave her in my capable hands. I am not a healer. I am not a healer. Abort. Abort mission. So there's no ice. Great. No, I'm not a healer, but apparently I healed her. You come back to us, thank the gods. Why am I back in Costa del Sol? Well, I have no idea. What happened to you out there? Were you swept away in a storm? Tossed from your boat by some eldritch horror from the depths of the sea? I fear my memory is still hazy, as I remember we sailed to the northern seas where, after braving the elements and some vicious fiends, set on making a meal of me, I succeeded in procuring the most pristine ice I've ever laid eyes upon. <laughs> Mind you, that's going to be crushed and made into ice cream. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't need to be that great. We began the journey back, and just as we were approaching Costa del Sol, it's no use. The only thing I remember is our vessel capsizing and my body being flung from the deck along with my hard-won supply of ice. But at least I made it back in one piece, and I have you and my friend here to thank for that. No. Oh, you're welcome. Oh my goodness. And she's like, what? What? Where did where did these come from? Oh, my dearest friends, you two survived the chip break. Oh, I could not be happier. These creatures are your friends. Look at them. How could they not be friends? They're cuddly wobbly. Aren't they lovely? We met upon one of the islands up north. I shared some of my treats with them, and next thing I knew, they were following me everywhere. They're gentle and strong and the most perfect companions, really. Alright, that's enough of the touching reunion. My precious ice is scattered all about the place. Go round it up and bring it here. On the double now. Grrr. The frosty fluff falls. <gasps> oh, look at the little bots. Bola bears. Oh my goodness, Ram. Oh, the polar bears got the ice. I didn't even have to do any hard work. Jill, look at that. They're quite clever, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Is that supposed to be her opening the box? Or what the fuck is she doing? She's smelling the box? Oh, lucky day. The seals are intact. The ice inside is undamaged and unmelted. This means only one potential rub remains. It couldn't be a rub. I'm so confused. What the fuck is a rub? As a matter of fact, the ice you see is everything I hoped it would be, which is why I'd rather my to my chagrin when I later discovered a dreadful fiend slumbered in the rather large chunk of ice. Oh, oh, okay. There's a sleeping evil dude in the ice that I have to take care of. Great. Yes, it's all coming back to me now. As we neared Costa del Sol, 
With the balmy winds drifting in, I heard a dreadful rumbling coming up from the cargo hold. This looks evil. I rushed down to investigate only to see the fearsome creature. It appeared rather perturbed by the heat and it suddenly began to swell larger and larger until BOOM! Uh oh. It would appear my own carelessness was the cause of our unfortunate incident. Fortunately, my furry companions and I survived the shipwreck and as my stock of the pure- as my stock of the purest ice Yet, I fear the fiend will be back in search of the icy home I so unceremoniously stole from him. Whatever am I to do? Well, I guess this is where I come in to help fix your problem. Have no fear. In Ferris over the years, my friends and I fought off more bombards than you can shake a stick at. Why, Bombard Buster could be my middle name. This character looks gankable. What the heck up? <laughs> now let's go appraise Hermaga of the situation. Surely he'll have an idea of how we can deal with the menace and kick the festivities off with a bang. Mm hmm. Oh my god, wait, they grew in size? They were the same size, and now it was like Goldilocks and the Three Bears. It was like baby mama and daddy bear. <laughs> what the heck? That's okay. They're cute anyway, that's okay. The eyes is saved, but there's an evil. Bomb monster after us. <coughs> ah, Valeria! I was wondering when I might hear back from you. And I see our star confection here has joined you as well. Pray tell, how did you fare? You need to choose the mount size at the end of the quest. The biggest one! In that case. Oh dear. So while the ice has been safely procured, a blustery bombard of behemoth-like proportions has been procured alongside it. No doubt that has something to do with the panicked screams I hear coming from the beach. Uh-oh. But not to worry, after all, what is the Moonfire Fair if not a season for blasting ill-tempered, hot-headed balloons out of the air? I know just a person to assist us in the effort. Just a moment now. Say no more, Master America, I'll stand ready, my friends. Who goes there? Whoa! Oh, it's uh... Is that a goblin? And a bunny. The brave leader of the bombardiers and the bane to bombards the realm over. Okay. Right. Apparently, these guys are heroes. Bagu too has come to save the day and he's brought a little... Fun little toys with him. What toy? Dude, put a shirt on. I'm I may still be new to this adventuring business, but I promise you that what I lack in experience, I make up for in pluck. Pluck, spirit, and our determination. This whole mess was my fault. And still so many of you have come to my aid. How can I ever repay you? By giving us polar bears. Nonsense, my dear. The ice you brought was at our behest. And all will be forgiven when you fashion for us the most delightful frosty dessert Master Gegaru has ever laid eyes upon. Besides, the exploits of bombard-busting adventures are sure to bring even more good publicity to the guild. It's a real place, but in Spain. Really? That settles it. Let's go out there and show this oversized frost bubble. We kick butts. What are you laughing at, Henny? Arr, 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 arr. <laughs> Let's go. A fate of bump can be committed by Disciple of War magic. That's good because I'm a Disciple of War. No! Wait, I have a mount. Yo. I have a mount. You're gonna take it down without me. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Okay, it's got lots of HP left. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, demount, please. Freeze, freeze, freeze. No, don't freeze me. Don't freeze me. Don't freeze me. Freeze someone else. Freeze someone else. Don't freeze me. I'm innocent. Take it down, though. Look at this guy. He's kind of cute, though. Can I have him as a pet? Maybe? I mean, he's kind of cute. Look at the little... Oh, look at him. 
He's just misunderstood, right? He's sad because his home is gone. So you are the warrior of darkness. Uh-oh! This is what happens when we don't pay attention to chat. Or when we pay attention to chat and not... Anything else. An oversized blue explosion bomber thingy. It's kind of cute. Dude, it's kind of... It's like it's, it's just misunderstood. You know? Look. I mean, look at this guy. Okay, he's gone now. He despawned really fast. Ooh, I got TP letters. Another oh, no, fair vouchers. Nice. Look, the ice bombard even went like ar blah 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 when he died. That's just sad. That's really sad. That's kind of cute. I want a teddy bear version. Exactly. Not to brag, but I managed to screw up my cup noodles. <laughs> How the fuck, Wobbly? How did you manage to do that? Ah, the look of relief and supreme satisfaction in your faces. It might just remind you successfully driven off the big blue ice bomb thingy. Yes. We scarcely broke a sweat while doing it. Ah. Uh. Oh, of course, it wouldn't be nearly so easy without Valeria on our side. You're welcome, guys. You're welcome. Oh, shucks. I'm blushing. I'm blushing. And yet we must remain ever vigilant. There is no telling when the dread creature's friends may return to seek their revenge. Oh shit, they're gonna seek revenge. Did we start a feud? <laughs> You're all truly heroes. All's well that ends well, I say. With that, I say it's time we retrieve our supplies from the beach. You just wait, my friends. I'm gonna prepare the most marvelous dessert this realm has ever seen. To be fair, ice cream is amazing. Ice cream is good stuff. Da, 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 da. Quest complete. Okay, give me the polar bear because you're so happy that I, yeah. I can't thank you enough. If it were not for you, I'd have been too busy running for my life to ever, ever think of making this awesome fucking ice cream. All's well that ends well. I finally get down to what I was brought here to do. I promise you all, I'll be done before you know it. So why don't you and Marla entertain yourselves for the time being? Yes. This I can do. If you mean giving me... Oh, I have to do stuff? I just want the polar bear mount, though. I never liked ice cream, it's too cold. Oh, that's fair enough. I thank you for your efforts to help dispatch the bombards. To think that such a calamity would befall us in the eve of festivities. But pray, don't be too hard, Nikki. 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 Whatever. That's fine. Oh, wait, you guys are childhood friends. You never told me that. We used to play together by the shore and one day we were set upon by a vicious monster. I thought we were we thought we were done for, but saved in the nick of the time by a kindly adventurer, swiftly dispatched the beast and whisked us away to safety. That's when I vowed I'd serve the guild and repay my debt to the brave soul who rescued me. Okay, onion potato. You got some special effects. I can see that. Who the heck is onion potato? <laughs> Meanwhile, Nekeke, how? Why can I? <laughs> uh, she's a genius in the kitchen since she was a little girl. She chose the path of culinarian in hopes of filling the bellies of adventurers all over with nourishing and toothsome snacks. Toothsome? Toothsome snacks. In the end, she found her calling making sweets as opposed to the sort of hearty meals that you and I might favor. Oh, excuse me, I like sweets. Okay, calm down. I do sweets. In any event, she's positively overjoyed that her latest creation will be present in front and center at the fair for adventures all over to enjoy. <coughs> Hello, Push. How you doing? Hi, Fish. <laughs> How are you? 
Thank you for, you know, making me sick, by the way. Spices, I forgot to mix it now. It just tastes like pasta without sauce. <laughs> Wobbly, you can just put the... Can't you, like, you get a little pouch with, like, the spices and stuff. You just pour it in now. It'll be fine, no? Maybe not as nice as if you cook the noodles in it, but you'll still get, like, the broth will still have flavoring. I didn't know when I got sick, I stayed in my room. Uh, yeah, but we were in a car together and you were sick like the day after, which means that you sweet me in your, when it, like in the incubation time. Mm -hmm. 100% blaming you. How are you uh, feeling anyway? Are you better? 30. I did, it's not the same. Oh my God. Reveal face down card. We're not playing Yu-Gi-Oh right now. Ah, Valeria, truly impressed by the way you chased off that bombard. CSI, I can't see. Why? One of the... Wh why? One would never imagine that this is your first time taking part in the festivities. Thanks to you, I think we can safely say the guilds put on another impressive show this year. It's only a matter of time before our halls are overflowing with inspiring adventures. Talk about making the best of a bad situation. Speaking of which... I heard Neke, Nekeke's night done with her delightful creation. I don't know about you, but I'm most eager to taste it myself. Believe it or not, I have something of a sweet tooth. So do I. I also have a sweet tooth. That was probably you that smeet that. No, because I'm still sick, dude. You were sick first, okay? Which means... Oh, my chocobo doesn't like swimming. Oh, man. But you were sick first. Which means I got it from you. I haven't been sick in ages. Oh no, that's what I was saying before. No, I haven't been sick in ages either. Because obviously everyone's, you know, finally washing their hands and shit. Oh, okay. I cannot swim under there. I was probably supposed to get up on this, wasn't I? No, I wasn't. There's no way up. Yeah, there is. Yeah, because people are, like, washing their hands, you know, distancing themselves, staying home, whatever, like, at the slightest symptoms because of COVID or whatever. So, I haven't had the common cold ever since this whole shit started. It's crazy. But it finally got to me. Why do you swim if you can let your chocobo swim? No, my chocobo disappears. My chocobo is like, uh. Uh, I don't do water. My chocobo left me. Oh, you're busy chilling, I see. What the heck? What's this you say? The fiends have been dispatched and my prize dessert ready for testing? Why didn't you tell me sooner? Oh, you fat ass. Was that it? Also, I wasn't supposed to speak to you. Yes, I was. Bye bye. I'm out. You're on your own. Asmin never washes his hands. Yes, I did fish. And I couldn't taste anything. Like. But it went away pretty fast. See, my chocobo dished me. Dished me. Well, we did a test as well. And it ended up being negative. So... Wasn't COVID, dude. And I have not been sick for over a week now. Well, that's good. But, you know, you gave it to Blood, who gave it to me. So. That's why. Okay, do I get my, do I get my polar bear now? That it was COVID's evil sibling or something? Yeah, probably. Just a nasty cold. You haven't come at a better time. I was just putting the finishing touches on my masterpiece. No, I don't want to wait. I want to try your ice cream now. <gasps> that polar bear. Well, that doesn't look like ice cream. That literally looks like ice. Adventures, Eorzy, and Sphergoer's friends. I am most proud to present my latest creation. I call it Costa de Hilo. And I promise you, it will please your tongue. Very much. <laughs> I fucked that. And make sure it doesn't melt. 
As well as to help all of you stay cool with Mr. Scorching Heat, I leave you with a present from my furry friend. What, what's he gonna ice breath everyone? Oh, yeah, he is. I guess. Yay! Hooray! Whoa! And the crowd goes wild! Well, success. Did my dessert agree with you? After all the travel I put you through, one can only hope so. Uh... It was simply sublime. Your friends put on quite the show. It was more than worth the trouble. It was... It was amazing. Now that's a relief to hear. If it provided you with true refreshment after all your travels, why, as a confectioner and culinary, and nothing would make me happier. And now your polar bear buddy wants to speak. Stay with me, right? Ever since you chased off those bone bars, my little friend there hasn't been able to take her eyes off of you. You just look at her face as if she's saying, Oh, misadventure, what I wouldn't give to join you in your travels. Uh, yes, I think I'm working on Sunday. I should be 100% back on by then, so. Oh, she'll be even the most wonderful company on the road. Yes, happy moon fire fair to you too. Give me this polar bear. Oh, look at the pudgy, pudgy, wudgy cuteness. Oh my goodness, give this to me. <coughs> A treat to beat the heat. I don't need the treat though. I just needed the... Uh the polar bear. You may now purchase wares from the Moonfire Fair vendor. Participate in the fade appearing in the southeast region of the fairgrounds to earn vouchers that can be exchanged for goods. Oh yeah. Okay, so which one's the vendor? Nope. Oh, there. It literally says vendor on you. Okay, I have... 15 of these. What am I buying? Outer furnishing. Flame tracer. Pinwheel. A firework. Blue sparkling fireworks. Fireworks. Okay, these are all fireworks. Is this it? Zippy, thank you for lurking. Good luck with your raid. I hope you get some loot. Hey, the raid's done. Did you get anything in? How'd it go? Okay, but this is like... Tabletop. Is this like stuff that I can put in my house if I get a house? If we get a boss, then I'll be happy. It's mythic. Oh, well then, a big good luck, Zippy. What have I missed? Sorry, head of focus. Oh, don't worry. I'm just there uh, browsing the vendor at the fair and. I got myself a polar bear mount. Whoop whoop. That was basically the important thing that happened today. Oh my goodness, look at this guy. Okay, wait, this this has to go somewhere else. Wait a second. Create a shower of delectable frozen crystals. Oh, it can actually do this? Oh, <gasps> what? It's got a mount special. I didn't realize that. So 
So the polar bear is important, but not the chocobo. <laughs> no, 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 no. The chocobo is super important too. You know, they all are. But have you seen this guy? Look how happy he is. He's so happy. He's like, ooh, he. We're going on an adventure with this little bouncy, 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 bouncy. <laughs> Chocobo is always best of it. Fish, have you played? Don't worry, I got the Chocobo too. I can't ride the polar bear. I can see under the skirt. Oh my god, really? Bear is perfect now for visiting Ishgard. Oh, is Ish... Oh, I was gonna say, it sounds like a cold place. I got a Chocobo too. Chocobo's happy. It's a happy, happy panda. Why is cat meowing so much? Nah, but other... Okay. <laughs> uh, it's not as important. Capiche? They're all as important. Chocobo is not a panda? No, but the polar bear is almost a panda. Yeah, two mounts in one day from zero mounts to two. Kill the polar bear and eat it up? That's not nice. I'm not gonna do that. That's not nice at all. That's no nice. You gotta be nice to things. Poggies. Hey CSR. How you doing, cat? Are you good? Okay, bye Caesar. Okay, I'm a happy panda now. What do you mean, nice? You only ride on him and never feed. Oh, hey, hey, hey. If they required feeding, I would feed. Yes, there was a cat. Kitty cat. Kitty cat, come here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come. Yeah, sorry. I know mommy's got so much shit here. How are you doing, kissy cat there? I'm sorry. There's so much stuff on mommy's desk right now. Oh, and also, Yin, yes. You were asking about the Polaroid before? I did. I did open it up. And and then I asked stream what the heck are all these buttons for? And then we were like, why is there batteries included? Look at it. Caesar, do you approve of my Polaroid? He gave it two sniffs. I was like, okay. Okay, it's treat time. Treat time. But yes. It's it's very, very cute. I have no idea what the plan for this is, but I've always wanted one. <laughs> so I finally got one. They said maybe we'll take pictures of Caesar's feet or something. <laughs> um, I'm not super great. Yin's really, LR, like Ethan's really good though. Or at least helps me with all my shit. Caesar, you want to do cat treats? Just round off the stream with some cat treats. Caesar only fans. Yeah, see, I knew you guys were gonna be interested in that. Got to see wifey's repping right side, even though it's not around when she reset. Yeah, she knows. She's like, I gotta go red. <laughs> hmm. Ah, you can't just grab my flesh cat. This guy is vicious. This guy is so vicious. Why are you so vicious, cat? No, up top. Oh my god, it's like... It's like you've never ever gotten food before. Bite him back. I think that only works on dogs. Or? <laughs> Yay, yeah, you silly kizzy cat. Are you happy now? You got some Cheetos? You happy you got some Cheetos? Alright, guys. I'm gonna end the stream a little bit earlier today. Uh, 
just because I don't want to kill it with my voice and I can feel it it's getting increasingly like itchy or whatever and I don't want to have another coughing fit and die on stream that would be immensely awkward uh <laughs> so I'm gonna no dying allow stop talking more playing but if I stop talking then everyone's gonna be like what the fuck is going on here Sure, a bit of Val is better than no Val. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. I'm hoping. Hoping I'll be back on track soon. Um, but I made it to level 30. Got my two mounts. All goods. Just say at the end of the stream, I forgot my mic was muted this whole time. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, that's, I should. I should have gone with that tactic, Guppy. Damn it. But I've already said that my throat's messing with me now, so I can't do that. Sunday next. Um, I'm actually working on Sunday, apparently. I kind of just got this info a while ago. <laughs> So, I will let you guys know on Discord if there's a, a stream this weekend, like Friday, Saturday. There might be. Because I feel like it's a very long time until Monday. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> but we'll see. I'll let you guys know on Discord. So, if you're not in Discord, you should pop in there. Because, you know, we're awesome. And I um, want to thank you guys so much for tonight and for being here. And thank you, Cade. Thanks so much, Cade. I'm glad you came. I'm glad you find you found your way over to our tiny little cozy community. I'm good. I'll just wait for the pickup line. <laughs> Uh, I need to start finding a new source of pickup lines or something else or recycle because I um I don't have uh, like I'm running out I'm running out of lines also my headset just muted itself completely what the heck cat did you mute my keyboard somehow or my headset somehow I don't know Hey there, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Um, you should also pop into Discord if you just got here to find out when I'm next live because I am popping up. Yes, I am. I'm sorry, radio. I don't want to because there's so many of you awesome people here and, you know, I want to play games and stuff, but I can feel like my voice or... It's not my voice really, but I can feel that my throat is... Is, uh, is giving up on me, unfortunately. And I don't want to sit here and, like, you know, have an itchy coughing fit or whatever. No, I'm sorry, Fade here. <laughs> I just want to point out, well, look at the wall. Wow, that the Horde are in the lead already. I get you. I get you. So, um... Yeah, hey cosplay diver. I'm sorry. I'm just popping off. I need to save my my voice. But uh, you want to join the Discord? There it is. Join the Discord, and then we'll see if there's an extra stream on Friday or Saturday. Otherwise, it is Monday next. I know it's such a long time. It's probably gonna be one this weekend because Monday's too long. She leaves because I cave. That's not true, fish. That's not true at all. I just need to rest my voice. I'm not. I'm not as fully back to normal as I thought I was, unfortunately. Running into the discos. Do it. I will see you guys on Discord. We will chat offline as we always do. You lovely peeps. We're gonna go see. Val, you're the most huggable streamer on Twitch. 
Oh, you're just saying that. No, I'm not. The boobs. You can have... You can have uggies. You can have uggies. I'm uggies. But, but the camera's off. I can't... I can't, like... It's like... It's more like that. There's a cringe hugs. <laughs> She's a solid 6 out of 10. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, I appreciate that. Appreciate that, Bri. Uh, Pepe. <laughs> oh my god. I know Lovely's playing Final Fantasy. I literally have her, like, slash raid in chat waiting to press enter. But you guys are being Pepe. <laughs> guys. I was like, you just banned Bri. <laughs> oh my goodness. You have angered my mods, Bri. <laughs> you did remove the ban, right? Yeah, you did. Okay, good. The ban has been removed. Uh, I had no influence over that. That was not me. That was true. That was radio. Okay, guys. I'm gonna... You're making me laugh too much, but it's not good for my throat. We're gonna do like that, because now there's a timer on the raids. Go give Lovely some love. I will see you guys on Discord, and I will see you soon, and then hopefully next stream, I will be 100% back to normal, and we can sit in game longer. Alright. Oh my god, where are we going? We're gonna go to a Lovely stream, we're called Lovely. She's super nice. <coughs> oh my god. <laughs> <clears throat> and exactly what I was hoping for wasn't gonna happen. It's now happening. So it's a great time to say goodbye. I love you guys. Good night. See you. Oops.